Good morning, afternoon, and evening, everyone. This is Hippo Tesla <laughs> doing episode five of Resident Evil Code Veronica X. And here in the audience, we have our <laughs> Joker tested drive. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna speed run it so bad, man. You're not gonna do I'm gonna speed run it three times before you even know what happened. <laughs> Hello there, everyone. Good day, good evening, and good morning. Let's start. Let's see. <laughs> One week world record. Hey, it's called Veronica after all. Hello, first of all, Zdravo Eko, Zdravo Nina, Zdravo Gagi, Zdravo Mama, Zdravo Tata, and all the other family. <laughs> I was, who's, who's, who's else there? Who's, bloop, who else is there? <laughs> Ljubka, hello, Delmar, Teste, hi everyone. <laughs> Resident Evil. Oh boy, Zdravo Gamute, Zdravo, Zdravo Čoveče. <laughs> 12, huh? Chris was right, we do need leading zeros. We're talking double digit numbers here. <laughs> Volume for me, there you go. Oh, it's saved with the lighter and everything. Look at that. Pretty good, pretty good. All right, my love for Code, Code Veronica just grows, which is great. What isn't great is, uh, I can't remember, did I save after the, the West Key cutscene yesterday? For the love of me, I know I said I'm gonna end it here, <laughs> but I'm not sure, I did. I think I did save, I, can't, I don't know. <laughs> I guess I gotta go there and find out. Oh yeah, Gamut, we counted yesterday, I know that, no spiders, no. I know that Code Veronica RNG is uh, pretty crazy, but... We've had, I needed eight regular, uh, what are you called, bowgun arrows to kill a bandersnatch, eight of them only, because I, I, I got into a spot where he got stuck on a balcony above me, so I could slowly shoot one by one, yeah, so I'm pretty sure the first one was around 19, but I could have missed some, because the, the first bandersnatch in the game I counted, and I was like, okay, he's weak to this, but then eight is pretty good way better than any other weapons so you know when any other weapon i mean like automatic weapons and and pistols so maybe maybe the i wouldn't be surprised if uh if it's stronger in chris's hands it should be but it's one of those things that's possible in these old games all in all amazing game guys just if you're like me and you didn't think this game is good i'll tell you the same thing i say for everyone to everyone who thinks outbreak is bad play it again now that you're an adult play it again <laughs> try it try what i did tell me if you like it then all right what was i doing we've seen shakshi Weshki. but uh so here here's the thing i'm gonna stop here for a second and then uh, <laughs> and then i'm gonna say this the story is classic like it's it's goofier it's even goofier than some other classic re's or some modern like the last re was pretty goofy near the end there <laughs> i think the i think re village wins with goofiness okay let's put that on the throne there but then code veronica is really goofy and that's all i saw in it but the gameplay value in this is huge because you go through all of this with claire and you know first time if you're playing it like i did you're oh we're nearing the end of the game but then what the fuck is up with the disc too and then you're on antarctica okay we're gonna finish this in another location then you think you're done with it but then games like like uh -uh. <laughs> you still have mr boulder puncher here and then you're playing with him but it's the design of the of the maps and the and and the whole how the game makes you access it how, how accessibility from the player side i don't know how to explain it but after the self-destruct system exploded, <laughs> that's a good plot device. Just hear me out. <laughs> Some of the walls are now open between rooms that weren't, like they were far away from each other when Claire was here. But then some other rooms or corridors, I think we have one here. Yeah, this is a good example here. So this, these used to be two separate rooms differently. So th there's a whole corridor here that's cut, but that, that Norton Hall there, that's a hole in the wall from the explosion. So it uses the same map, but it totally changes its approach. And now, now at like a 35 year old, I appreciate this a lot. I don't know why they never did anything like this before. You kind of feel that in Outbreak games when you play familiar locations like the 
I'm not gonna call it nest, fuck that. Like the Umbrella Laboratory from RE2 or the uh, Raccoon General Hospital. I'm not gonna call it Spencer Memori Memorial, fuck you <laughs> and fuck Spencer Memorial. And uh, what was the third one? I think there was another location that we visit. But yeah, uh, the, the RPD, yeah. So the, they're, they're the same locations we know, but they shuffled something about them. But here, they did it in the same game. And that's fucking genius. Seriously. Well, camera, yeah, camera angles too, of course. But there's the there's whole there's a whole piece. No, Zuma, there's a whole floor or two of this facility that we didn't even see with Claire. It was hinted something's gonna be there. That tank, when uh, Alfred moves it for the first time, you see that ammo, a uh, pistol ammo behind the tank. I thought, how the fuck was I supposed to pick that up? You know, back when I first played it. But then when you come back with Chris. If you remember, because you can't immediately see it. You're like, oh, there was some ammo there. It's still there. That is game design top. So I'm putting this right next to Outbreak. <laughs> In terms of, wow, what the fuck did you do here, people? Why didn't you make more like these? Honestly. Really good. So that's me fanboying over this. Like 20 years, 20 years too late. But better late than never. Right? So let's go down here. What, what was I gonna do? If I go down, get down. I cannot. The the ladder is down. That's right. So I gotta. What do I need to do? Use the. I think I need to use the elevator. See, I I totally know this part with Claire, but now with Chris, even though I was here yesterday, it still it makes the map itself a puzzle. Amazing. When I had to sit there and think with. with if I go here, if I fold, it's like origami. If I fold it this way, then it's a swan. But if I do it this way, it's a police car. <laughs> Hi, everybody. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Sash. <laughs> <laughs> you good, kitty? Can you settle there on your living couch? So, what was it? We're second floor now, right? Yeah, I went there, then through there, then through there, then down the stairs. So what I need to do, I need to get that thing. Oh, where's the vent ventilation thingy? Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I know now. Yeah, I remember. All right. <laughs> Gamut says, Drava, Mrs. Hippie. <laughs> I love, I love that he calls you that. <laughs> Wait, how the fuck did I get there? I can't get this way, right? This way is clock, cock blocked, not clock blocked, cock blocked. What about this way? Can't remember how I got there. See what I mean? Like, the whole map is shuffled. I was here yesterday, I can't remember. Now that that's fallen down. If I go there, then down the stairs, I'll end up there and then I can... Oh yeah, that's it, that's it. I'm on the, yeah, I'm on the right path. So... With all this that I said, expect... Oh, Jesus fucking Christ! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Expect more... Code Veronica streams this year. Outside marathons and all. Jesus. Okay. Gentlemen's reset. As soon as I figure out how this goes... I think I should have taken the elevator. Yep. Okay, I see where I did wrong. The elevator. Because I, uh, I unsealed that. Yeah. Let's not waste time and money. Oh, uh, time is money. But let's not waste time and health. Because I went the other way. <laughs> sure, why not? Attempt. Attempt, yes. Definitely. So, remember, our Outbreak was the first RE where I really, really wanted to unlock everything and uh, <laughs> catch, <laughs> gotta catch them all. <laughs> Be the best that ever was. And I'm proud of that. <laughs> How quickly I got from zero to hero and OB. I would love to do that with this game too so let's say this is the second re where i want to do that just a point just the, just the just the fact that it's that i have the urge to do that means they did something right okay so instead well, of what i did and get slapped by the hunters i don't want to return there ever again if not net oh because they're there yeah 
would they respawn like if i kill those would the hunter disco disco hunter cameras be back i'm not sure how that works go to b1f that's right so many i could have gone the other way too totally just more hunters for well more there are hunters and there's uh always well, sounds like something's growling there i guess i boost some volume i lowered it so it doesn't echo into uh wait what if i light this i i think i tried but still i somehow remember lighting i probably the one in the yeah it's the one in the crypt that's right we killed them all here right and then went that away And use the key, okay, but I'm missing a key item somewhere, am I? I'm trying to find my way here. There, there, there. Hey, I didn't even try to go towards palace. What happens if I try that? Let's try that. Because I've been here, I think I picked up everything there was to pick up. So it's a tough one. Only one save allowed. No first aid spray. Beat under four hours. Save Steve and Rodrigo quickly. Give Rodrigo the hemostat and collect all maps. Hello, those are all the things I like doing anyway, so. Perfect. Perfect. What about the indigo blue portion? It's also down there, huh? So that's cool, because uh, one save, that's a challenge accepted. <laughs> no first aid spray, I don't use them in. I think any RE, not even the remakes. I, I know it do, it doesn't work like that in the remakes. They don't lower your score, but it's a it's a matter of principle and pride. <laughs> Beat under four hours. That's gonna be a toughie. That's gonna have a uh, multiple attempts to memorize the paths and everything. But again, like in Outbreak, it's very possible with repetition. Save Steve. Save Steve. I wonder what that like, where where we're coming. No spoilers for Lupka or uh, somewhere before. Rodrigo got it. Okay, just get out there. Four explosive arrows in the worm. Done. And give him the Hema stat and collect all maps. So everything except the speed is very plausible. So the speed, I guess, I'll get that by practice. But it is... I am very attracted to that idea. But that one save, there is one save, right? At the Antarctic base where you get the free save. That's the only one you can use. So at least it lets you save. Nobody there? It at least it lets you save, you know, once. So you don't have to do it all from start. It's like, it's like doing two long scenarios in Outbreak. Solo, like DD and EOTR. And you can save... You can save a DD. Yeah. So you can save after you finish DD and then you gotta... Holy shit! Okay, I did not expect that. What are we gonna do about those guys? Explosive arrows. That's right, I got explosive arrows. Ten of them. Blast one, blast the other. Rinse and repeat. Or just don't fight them. I don't know if there are some items here, so... I'm gonna try. I can't remember if it remembers their position, but... Okay. Oh shit. Fuck you guys. Okay. Two of them wasted, but uh, you live and you learn. <laughs> he does here. Yeah, they changed his. Look. He's the one protagonist they use the most times in these games, yet they change his look the most time. Like every game. It's another Chris. I think the most consistency is between Chris, Resident Evil 5 and Resident Evil 6. Yeah, I shouldn't have killed them, but 
You know, let's make it safer. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm glad I did. More shotgun shells. Explosive. So fucking arrows are op way more OP than I thought. <laughs> Explosive ones are the best against these hunters, apparently. And, oh, I can't go there. But I can go here, right? Right. There you go. That's how I go there. Did I bring health? Yeah, I did. In case I want to be stupid. Yeah. And then in RE7, they were like, we're making everyone photorealistic. Uh, here's this new guy who's totally not Chris, but just go with it. We'll call him Redfield. He doesn't even say, say Chris. It says Redfield. And then... <laughs> what about this? It's the... That's where the turntable goes, right? I think. Yeah, that's where the turntable goes. And that's the other lift that Zombie said. It's another lift. Okay. Wow. More. Give me more. By someone. But did you say someone? I think it's when uh, Mace had Tyrant attacked uh, Claire and it exploded. Poor Chris. Just put him to rest. Yeah, that's the, that's the elevator I came with. So it's right next to that one. I wasn't too far off, zombie. If you're listening in the future. <laughs> the doors... The cargo lift door has different look on the inside and outside. It's just crazy. Who put the new herbs here? Like, is that what Wesky was doing? Well, when Claire left, he was planting herbs around the base. Device controls the room's air condition. Oh, really? Nice. Happy to hear that. Yeah. I totally get it. You know what? Do I have... I gotta have at least one so I can mix it with red. Or... Nah. Be stupid and brave and don't do it. There you go. Problem solved. If we find more reds... Stupidly forward. That's the name of the game. Yes. I don't know if you were there yesterday when I was saying... That it hit me what's so different about this game. Even though it looks like a classic RE, it's... <laughs> it's the architecture. The first three games were set in the US and that was very evident. Even when you're a kid, you don't know where... where what's... <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> you don't know what's... Uh... Where's New Jersey or California, from my perspective, a little Serb. Um... Come on! <laughs> I just gotta finish this thought so I don't get lost. Uh, you can f plainly see it's in the US, but this one was heavily inspired by European Gothic architecture. And even the story is told... Now this I found on the wiki, actually, some, some somewhere. Uh, it's told through a lullaby. Well, very, very middle age, Middle Ages European. So that's uh, that's a big difference. It, it, it looks the same, but it's not the same. Let's try to blow this guy up. So he's kind of shooting over their heads, so I gotta be better at it. I mean, come on! Come and kill you, Hunter! What the... Oh, that's just bullshit. Come on! Just die! Screw you, buddy. It is. Uh, no, it's actually in the Southern Ocean. Uh, South America or Australia? But it's near, near, near Antarctica, yeah. Hello, Mayo. I mean, come on, Mayo. Hello to the stream. <laughs> come on, Hunter. You made, me, you made me waste the most explosive weapon. Do I want to go here? Let's, let's go. No, wait. Take the lighter. Where are the items? Come on, give me the items. More items. I need to make an empire of herbs. <laughs> I kill you, stupid hunter. The elevator iron bridge is stopped upstairs. 
Oh no, how will I ever? I guess I have to go back. Yeah, it's in South Pacific. <laughs> Mayor, you should make a series of it. What about the cargo elevator? Elevator. Elevator. Can we move the cargo elevator? No. The machine is not working. And that zombie we saved, he's gone. He left us. He didn't like what we did to him. He felt disrespected, so he left. I am a calm Arnold today. I am, I am practicing to be calm, because people told me that I go off the rails, and then I just go, come on, you gotta do it, and people feel pressure. I don't want to put pressure on anyone. People have put pressure on me in the past, and look, look what happened. Look, look at all the Terminators past. Terminator 2, they all sucked ass. Do you want that? Nobody wants that. It's a... Do not lower the lever. I want to see what's on the other side. What is behind door number 2? Maybe a can of whoop ass. How do you know his family is buried on the island? Where was that mentioned? I'm really interested in that story. Oh, hello there, Spray. I don't need you. Bye-bye. The door has been broken. What about this? This device controls the bridge's oil pressure. The automatic control device is out of order. It must be operated manually. There is a notice. Operate. No, read the notice. Even though I was elected to lead and not to read, I will read it. Manual operation. Number one, supply oil to the 10 liter tank using three cylinders. Number two, the standard oil amount must be maintained. If oil isn't at the standard amount of seven liters, the device will not activate. Be careful. You want to get sassy with me? Pressure gauge. What is this? It looks like a party. Yo guys, you got some beer? You know, even though I'm originally from Austria, I have lived in the US so long, I have no idea what 7 liters is. So I will just do my best. I guess it's the same as 7 ounces. But only in liters. <laughs> uh. I was I was examining those graves like crazy yesterday. It just says uh, from Islands Inhabitants. I gotta, I gotta check that. I was really interested. That I knew there has to be something there. <laughs> I'm just a muscle dummy. Come on, oh no. My doctor said do not fee do not make people fear you. Because they will be afraid. You don't want them to be afraid. They will never call you to play another Terminator. Supply oil oh, okay, I can't I can't memorize when I'm doing the voice. Supply oil to the tenth liter tank using three cylinders. Oh, it's just one of those uh, Seven liters total? Seven liters? You know what? Just try it. What's the worst that can happen? It is. Yeah, okay. It's got to be it got to be seven in the main one. And one of them is broken. The one is broken. So this is like Die Hard 3 all over again. We got five and three. If we put... Aha, uh -huh, I get it. We got to make seven, right? And it fits... Okay, so I see... Put that here. No, that's not what I wanted. I messed it up already. That is bullshit game. That is not what I wanted. I thought I could put this into this, then get two liters, put them into ten, and then add another five liters and get seven liters. But I didn't do that. Okay, I guess whatever I put three, I get eight. <gasps> ho 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 ho. So we're doing die hard three, huh? And we're not driving a Yugo. It says it fits 10. 3? Okay, let's try it. Because it all goes down, so I guess. You can't add 1, so it's 8. What if I press this? It just empties everything, okay? I guess. 
that's why he's got me as soon as i understand what's happening like i get it that one is broken so i gotta make with five and three somehow i thought i could put five you know into three like add it here and they get two and it would be easy but how the fuck do you even do that <gasps> wait three i get it three three and then out yes hold on yes yes got it got it and then three again it's just three you don't need the five okay there you go and then oh you need the five there you go and now we're left with two liters and then five and two is three is seven there you go there you go uh that's two and then that's five ha I watched Die Hard 3 too many times to fail at this game. Beep, 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 beep. Beep, 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 <laughs> Oh, nice test day. Thank you, man. Thank you, Gamut. Holy fucking shit, guys. I know it's a party, but nobody invited me, so I have to kill you. I, pro I could probably run away, but I'm really curious what's behind no, number two. Guys, this isn't really scary. You're not really running at me, bro. You're more like coming very slowly at me. Everyone dead. Oh, that was too easy, guys. What was the point of that ambush? You didn't even ambush me properly. I'm not surprised. What now? <laughs> For him. There we go. I knew there was something there. I wonder if I could take it before he, before they got up. Huh. We'll find out next time. Wait, I forgot I got the best weapon in the game. The lighter. That's it, I guess. Let's go. I didn't even try the other thing, so I'm just gonna guess that this is what I had to do to move the elevator. The game expected me to try and elevators go like, donk, donk, can't do it. Try it now. Oh, so what would happen if I tried? Would it be like... I am good enough to jump. I can climb an island, but I cannot jump two meters down. I really suck at these. Well, it's not really two. It's about three meters, probably, but still. Chris Redfield should be able to jump. Let's Actually, let's look at it. He's he, Let's say he's about 100 and... 70 centimeters? He's not awfully tall. Let's say just shy of 2 meters. And then this ceiling here is... Wow, it's really tall. Actually, no, I'm wrong. So, he would have some... Maybe 5 meters to jump. Well, what is that for Chris Boulder Punching Redfield, huh? What is that? I don't like the sound of that. Whoa, boy, big boy. Get up, get the fuck. All right. Indeed. Jumping me, hunting me. Die, please. Yeah, I'm trying to solve a mystery here, guys. It's just impolite to, to interrupt. It's rude. You know, I am... You know, I am... Ugh. I feel the, the pain from losing those uh, quite several explosive arrows to their... To their shitty... Wow, okay, that's not what I wanted to do, sir. But you're still alive? What the fuck? Okay, Eileen, I'm coming. I hope your back is as red as I remember it. <laughs> I really feel losing those... What? What's up with their eyes? That doesn't even make sense. Did they have... Did they have sex with Sexy Wesky? Everybody get down. 
get down again. Huh. Now it's gonna comment on the art. Uncultured swine. <laughs> Alfred Cuckoo. Every day he's out there making undead moo moo. You know, guys, you inspired that lyric with the moo moo and everything. Oh boy. You're fucking kidding me. One what the hell was that? How the hell did I kill a hunter with one pistol bullet? Was that lucky? Is that a trap? Should I be scared? Nothing is being shown. What the fuck? Did you see that? Was that a critical hit? Is that because I up upgraded the Glock? What does it say? It just says modified. It's a modified. Thank you, game. A lot of info. Yeah, that shouldn't be possible. What the fuck? Just roll with it. Oh, okay. Electricity. Chris doesn't understand this. Well, I'm just gonna waste the bullet then. And reload. I f I'm feeling lucky here. <laughs> now that's... That's how I want all the hunters to go down. To get down. <laughs> this device supplies electricity to the lift. Cut off the electricity. Not yet. Not yet, my friend. It's empty. Oh boy, is that where the Quentin Tarantino came out of? Or is that... <gasps> That's where Sexy Wesky released the hunters. I guess we'll have to... How can we... Can I edit that? Fuck, let's just turn it off. Well, hold on. Fuck that. We, we don't have... Thank you. I'm just gonna turn it off. Where is it? Link protection, something, something, yada, yada. Blah, 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 blah. Well, fuck me now that I need it. I can't find it. There's a Super Nintendo control. Ah, commands, no. Quotes, timers. Fuck, I can't remember. I'll find it for tomorrow. Ah, okay, that, that explains a lot. Hell, hello, David. Hello, always coming in. And not even a good day, anything. Just like, right away, a code Veronica fact. Did you see that, David? Did you see that lucky shot, man? That was, that was amazing. It was too good to be true. I'm expecting him to get, it, to get up again. That's what we need. That's why I'm coming here. I need the proofs that I'm a sailor, a soldier, and a pilot. All, of, all three. That was, that was really unexpected. Okay. So, I don't know if you heard that, I, if you were there at the start, David, my boy, but I just put Code Veronica squarely next to Outbreak on my list of best RE games. Very underrated, very good. And I had a whole speech about how the environment changes. You get got back to the second map, but... Um, Ah, okay. You would be proud of me. You would be very proud of me. I guess we're going up. Yeah. Let me sing you the song of my people. Moo, moo, moo. Okay. Someone seems to have used the submarine. How the fuck do you even know it's there? I can't. I mean, <laughs> that, that's what I was saying. Uh, Story-wise, it's one of the goofiest. The only goofier one is RE8. <laughs> Near the end, especially. Not even the first three games. RE8. <laughs> it's really ridiculous, some plot points. Like I, Yesterday, I was asking, does anybody know or understand... Why the fuck did Claire Redfield go all the way to France, infiltrate an umbrella facility to find her brother, to be captured, and then just email Leon, and Leon immediately sends Chris? What the fuck was the point of infiltrating an umbrella facility with nothing but a... not even properly dressed, just a gun, a pistol, HP Browning, and a will to fight? That's all she... that's all she brought with her. But then, when she got captured, she was like, Chris, come here, and here's Chris. Couldn't you do that before? Send an email to Leon, be like, 
Hey, can you find my brother? Oh, on my way. Here we go. Blah, blah, blah. Done. No game. <laughs> but I guess then it wouldn't be a game. It would even make more sense if this part was played by Leon and not Claire. I know they were both in uh, RE2. I guess they wanted to mix it up, but... Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry, but this stunt puts her... <laughs> with... Puts her on the pedestal with Chris, if not even lower. <laughs> even he didn't do something dumb as this. But gameplay-wise, it's one of the best... RE games, so I'll need that, that as well. Okay, I remember I'll need that. I'll need more explosive arrows for... Well, I don't. Now that I have the shotgun, it kind of steps in for them. But yeah, so the... The, the bow gun is... Really good. S so much weaponry, so much... Look, the, the whole... I can't. The, the map is amazing. It's a puzzle in, in and out of itself, just bravo, bravo developers. If you hear me, bravo. Make another one, please. Oh, wow. Not good, guys, not good. I killed you once, just not, doesn't work like that. I'll be right back. Well, it's trying to try to use my iframes. Let me counter that. Don't make another RE8. I will set myself on fire. Thank you. <laughs> just ignore him. Can't hurt you if you if you don't look at him. Just go like this. <laughs> he can't hurt you. Imagine that, like, just, I'm just passing, don't, don't mind me. <laughs> They're all like, oh, I guess we're not gonna cut his head off. Fuck you, fuck you. Oh, you're in my way, bastard. How the fuck? I just cured. I just cured my illness. Pee pee slap, and there you go. Instant caution. So I do want to go up now. Get down, get up. I don't want to go up because... Where did I need to put those proofs? Where was it? Here? I, I went somewhere here, did I? I think. Hmm. Nice. I'm pretty sure there's a whole... If, if there isn't like a YouTube sound effects video for every Resident Evil, and it, I, like, it's, let's say 80% there, there, there is. Hold on. Where did I need to use that? I can't remember now. Shit. But, um... Oh, they can? Yeah, let's avoid them totally. But there's there's definitely a, an RE soundboard for any phone. Or get any PC Resident Evil. Resident Evil 1 is the easiest. Because it actually uses uh, Windows waveform audio. Which you can play anywhere. Where do I use the fucking proofs? I think it was... I'm just gonna go. Just, it's not a big base. At some point... I'll come across something. Well, that's a cheap trick, guy. I'm trying to drink here. Ah, thank you, Gammy. Thank you, my man. Hey, don't lose your head. Do I think I'm on the right path? No, wait. Why would I go here? When I can just go here. I know which way I'm gonna take. Oh yeah, I got some really good news to share. So, last year... 
David got his hands on a Japanese copy of Code Veronica, but since we don't have a Japanese Dreamcast, we just tucked it in <laughs> until we get one. And then we got the PAL version, which, as we know, the disc one wouldn't work for the stream. We're working on that, getting at least another disc one, if not all of it. But doing some research, trying to, you know, prepare for eventual actual Dreamcast Code Veronica stream. It turns out that the Japanese copy, my friend here, Nab, is the limited edition with the, that has some differences. Now, I know that from what I read... Was it here? Yeah, that's where the elevator is. From what I read, it's not just the box that's different. It's got that queen-ish uh, art on the sleeve. But there's something different with the start menu, like the, the start screen. And probably something else. It just, I found some old articles and newer ones and older ones that say that it's, they did change something in the game for people who pre-ordered in Japan originally. So that ver version was only released in Japan as a limited edition. So I can't wait to get to that. And David's working on a way to get us boot that shit and play it. Which I can't wait. But first, like I said, <laughs> like Gamma said, a rank attempt. Uh, I'll play it at least once more, if not twice, just so I know what I'm doing. So when I, you know, when I get to the Japanese version where I'll understand exactly nothing. Wait, I went the wrong way. <laughs> uh, I'll, uh, man, there's no contest there. What kind of question is that? <laughs> You know, I just want to get to a point where I'm comfortable playing it without understanding what the text says, especially for the puzzles, like the, like the family lineage puzzle, Jim or Chris. It's like saying bread or shit. Which one do you like? Uh... <laughs> Kevin and Leon. Now that's a choice. I could. That's a. That's a. That's a poll I could get get into. Still, Kevin. <laughs> I just Kevin just grew on me a lot. But yeah, there's like I said, there's no contest. When Lube can, can tell you instantly, Jim, you know <laughs> there's no fucking contest there. <laughs> that's right, because I guess the lasers are very lasery. RGB. Oh, he took them in the order, RGB. Nice. So it goes military, navy, air force. There is some kind of lever. Lower it. You could have, like, if you're handy, man, you could have just, I don't know, gotten a stick and pulled it down. Oh boy, we're going even deeper. I feel like something scary is about to happen. I better go save. RGB protection. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the flurry attack is one of the best things in all of Resident Evil, period. That's a good name for it. I never heard that. I'm going to use that now. I call I call it infinite combo, but flurry is much better. So flurry attack is just so OP. I never understood as a kid why Jim has such pathetic HP, but now I get it. They had to they had to balance him out somehow. Otherwise, it would just be unfair. No everyone would just play Jim's. <laughs> he can dodge, he can he can lick the floor with Oh boy. Why is it back now? I just want to save my game. So what's what's beneath there? Oh, should I have gone? Can I kill that thing? Oh boy. Oh. Yeah. Does Cindy have more HP than Jim though? I'm not sure about that. I know Alyssa has. Yoko doesn't. But not sure about Cindy. 
I think it goes Yoko the least, Cindy, and then Jim, right? But it's it's almost negligible difference, right? Yeah, he's got more. Yeah, okay. Still Yoko. I'm sorry, but still Yoko. <laughs> Yoko can Yoko has iframes. Chris has. He's there. He exists. <laughs> Yeah, that's right. Alyssa has pretty decent HP. So both Alyssa and David surprised me with their HP values being as high as they are. Oh, motherfucker. Should I have even got gone to save, huh? Is there a boss? I just one question. Is there a boss battle where I did that thing? Because if there's no boss battle, I don't know what's happening. I better save. Fuck, 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 Oh, I hate these things. Just throw hunters at me from, like, from ceilings or whatever. D don't do this. It just makes me nervous. I'm gonna bring one of these. I'm gonna use this. I did say I'll use it if I have more than two. There you go. Fine and dandy. And I'm gonna save. <laughs> Yeah. See, I expected David to have equal or less than George. I get Kevin being a police officer, you know, being in shape, having, you know, it's he's got to be in shape, man. But I'm going to bring that. I have a feeling I'll have be able to melt it pretty soon. Submachine guns. Is any of this worth it? Like, I'm not going to use a lot of these weapons. Huh. No one wants to tell me, huh? Okay, I'll find out on my own. If I die, I'll just bring another weapon. Problem solved. There's a big salamander in lower catacombs that shoots electricity in the pool. You don't need to fight it. Just jump in the pool and take the plate. Oh, the blue plate. Okay, okay. Okay, you mean the albinoid, right? The electric thing? I'll, I'll try to avoid it. And when I do that, I need to come back here regardless. Oh, I should have just gone down. Don't come back. Dodge all this. So I gotta wait for them to close their little... Pesky eyes. Oh boy. Close it. Close it. Oh boy. Okay, okay. I thought there's a there's another monster I forgot about. Makes me very nervous. This makes me as almost as nervous as Nosferatu. Radu Radu Nosferatu. Okay, I can I can do this. I'm pretty sure I can dodge these things. Last time, even the hunter despawned, so I think when I do my thing, they might despawn again because they seem to come and go depending on you know what the plot needs right now. Kevin is strong and athletic, but he's slowly ruining it with cigarettes and liquor. I think that's why he's weak to the virus. Well, that's 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 brilliant. That's brilliant. That makes sense. Yeah. I I always wonder why Jim is, but then Sasha said, "Wouldn't you be too if you kissed the floor at the first sign of danger?" Oh, where where is it? Is he even coming out here? Okay, I can do this. It's very quick, even. Oh, 
At least he's doing the same thing and not moving. Ugh. The depth perception is really... Man, this makes me nervous. I don't know. It's just a camera that's gonna send the hunters. There's nothing scary about it, but here we are. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a camera that's gonna send the hunter think about those words <laughs> oh nobody said anything about giant fucking spiders oh and I didn't bring a blue that's how you learn that you shouldn't eat doo doo dooby dooby doo Dee dooby 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 doo. Climb down the ladder, dooby dooby dum dum. Dooby dooby dum dum. Dooby dooby dum dum dum. David and George are exposed to nasty stuff all the time, so they're more resistant to the virus than Kevin. You know what? I like your logic, man. Oh, there we go. Blue. Take a blue. For me and you. Take a blue. Another double green. Blup, blup. Right. Albinoid, albinoid. Electric fucker, albinoid. Can he swim? Yes, he can. He can electrocute your balls. Look out, here comes the albinoid. She's just like. That's your thing, huh? You're not even gonna get out of the water, are you? Oh, look at that. So it just looks scary, but it's not scary, actually. It's one of those monsters, huh? <laughs> Cindy hates messes and stays away from nasty stuff, so it's why her virus gauge spikes so much when a zombie... Holy shit, Gamut, you've been thinking about this. Can I say about Yoko? Can I? Can I? Can I tell about Yoko? I think I know why Yoko uh, is... Uh... That's the... That's the that's the one that's broken. I was on the other side of this. Look at me, Ma. I was here. On the other side of it. Yeah, that's... It looks like it's the... Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Not just guinea pig. We know that she donated... Her uh, blood... And her blood and I think some other tissue uh, to create the T-virus, the Epsilon strain of the T-virus, which caused the outbreak. So it would make sense she's the, she's most resistant to it. It came from her. Just ignore it. Good thing he didn't do that before I grabbed it. A charge! I'm weak to electricity. Oh, that's my one weakness. How did you know that? Oh, he's not scary at all. Why was I afraid of this? He's not even coming out of his pit. So anything else here? It's not that scary. What is this supposed to be at all? Like Alfred's private pool? Up, up and away. <clears throat> me, 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 me. Spider Man, Spider Man. Eats a shell from my shotgun. Eat a cock if you can. Stupid, stupid Spider Man. Oh boy, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's pointless then. Just to, just to scare children like me. Oh, my shoulder hurts, man. I better warm it up. It's, it's, not, it's you know, Ruma? What do you call it? Oh, he's gone. So, like, whenever plot demands them, they'll be there. Well, if someone's rheumatic, how do you call, how do you say it in English? When you got, like, you know, bone, painful bone disease? R rheumatritis? <laughs> Something like that. I never thought about that. It's very, I heard that word thousand times 
in Serbian, Reuma, but for fuck's sake, I can't think of uh, what it's called. In English. Arthritis. Arthritis? Really? I thought arthritis is like in fingers only. There you go. I was gonna say arthritis, but I thought, said, I thought to myself, don't be stupid. It's not arthritis. Apparently it is. So yeah, my arth my shoulder arthritis hurts. <laughs> I gotta warm it up with this lighter. So wait, I wanna mix the Clements with the Eagle Plate. Eagle! And then we get the Halberd. The Halberd of that. It's an object that has been placed on the Eagle Plate. It's made of gold. Gold! And looks like a middle age halberd. That's also you're pretty European. Weep. <clears throat> oh, I didn't know I did not know that. So like all my fear of these fuckers, I should have just avoided them when I do a th the thing I need to do. That's it, they're gone. No! Oh shit, did I fuck up? I fucked up. I, no, I'm not ready to go, man. Wow, wow. God damn it. Hold on, Claire. I'll save you. What, this cheesy? Nah. It's like Kljubka yesterday saying, this is a very weird RE. <laughs> All the other REs are totally logical, but this one, this one's weird. <laughs> <laughs> it is different though. Lovingly different. <laughs> you can't use a chopper every time, man. You gotta use different vehicles. It is a veto, please. <laughs> Vertical. What, what, what was it? Vertical takeoff and landing. A Harrier. A Harrier with a halberd on it. Okay. Just roll with it. And it makes sense, back to the gothic architecture of the buildings here. It makes sense. Remember the Spencer's estate uh, or umbrella executive retreat was also made with... Uh, well, it's more like... I, I said it yesterday. It's not gothic, but it's the sister. The, the later one, it's called... Victorian, Victorian architecture, but uh, with the lighter in hand, he he traveled here with the lighter in hand, holding his shoulder. That you gotta love that. Yeah, that's where we saw that we, we we were here with Claire, but there was no plane. I must look for Claire. And yeah, uh, <clears throat> <laughs> yet he didn't crash it. Point to Chris. Point to Chris. <laughs> Wait, left or right? That looks like an elevator. Should I try? Yeah, let's try it. Caution, emergency evacuation elevator. Okay, so that's that's for end game. I'm gonna take it. Huh. So no items. I'm I'm gonna complain. Wait, there's another VTOL? The one that Alfred got here, I guess. Christ. <laughs> I love that autocorrect. <laughs> you know, that it could be, you know, it could be that Chris just said, Jesus, take the wheel, and, uh, and that's how he landed. So it was Christ piloting it after all. Okay, what the fuck is that? Is that, is that, is that, uh, is it killable? What's her face? Uh, Alexia's extension. I guess we get a second. Oh! You said you're gonna retreat. Oh, there we go. Wow. So it is very... Damage with this thing is very, very random. Die, please. He died at the end. 
I hope you clipped that one bullet hunter death test day. I didn't see that if you did. My bad. Wait. Okay, Monica. Was Monica here? Because I see everything's freezing. Oh, I know what I want to do. I want to visit my old friend that's going to give me shotgun shells. Ask him a few questions. Okay, I know where I am. This map shouldn't change too much, I think. That's to his left, yeah. I mean right. My left, his right. Okay, it's been only a few hours. How did this happen? How How is it so freezing that the, the water froze in a few hours? Is there more of them? Oh, there is more of them. Hello. Oh, well, that was kind of stupid of me. You know what? You gotta roll with the consequences. You you asked for this, just go with it. Ah, oh my god, it worked. One shell turns into seven. You don't have that power, zombies. Man, if you don't blow their heads out, they're just invincible. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, it does. Re it does. I think that's what they were going for. Down, boy. Alrighty. Alrighty then. Where's that dual aluminum case? Hell yeah. Can you even open it without lockpick? There's something else here. Yes, the shells I saw earlier. Nice. Alrighty then. Um, I, I, I mean... <clears throat> <laughs> Thank you for that wa raid, for that wait. <laughs> Thank you for that raid, sexy Wesky. Hello, raiders. Welcome, welcome in. Hello, Simon. Good evening. The forest. Wesky really likes the forest. I'm glad you like that game, man. A metal processing device. It's broken and cannot be used. Did you have fun, Wescaroni? Everyone's dead. Happy to see you here, Wesker. Professor. Well, I think I got everything. If I do this a bit more, it'll turn into my own purgatory. Hello, my friend. Hello. How are you today, Wesky? Or this this night? I'm doing great, man. I'm loving this game. So this is basically the third time I think I'm going to finish Code Veronica ever. And I love it so much. I just, tonight I put it right next to Outbreak. That's how much I love it. And you know what I feel, how I feel about Outbreak. I feel strongly. Oh, nice. <laughs> peaceful. <laughs> it was nice and peaceful. But how is that guy there? How is this? Oh. <gasps> Can I, can I ice skate? Can we ice skate? Oh, we can ice skate. Look at that. I'm in Zelda, apparently. Yep, so the map changes again. You gotta love this game. It's... Can't take any more items. Okay. I know they're all gonna get up. Nice and peaceful. Wesky camping in the forest, cooking... <laughs> cooking monster people living there. <laughs> Just nice and peaceful. <laughs> Fell asleep to the sounds of uh, inhumane screams. Ah, I'm burning a fire. Oh. <laughs> nothing here. I mean, nothing here. <laughs> you think we'll finish the game tonight? I'm pretty confident we will. As little as I remember, it's um, it, it's all pretty logical for an RE. Next, I want to go to a safe room. I'm glad you do. I'm glad you do, Wesky. 
I was a dumb, uh, salty kid, and I didn't like it because it was hard. But I, I adore it now. It is too good. It was way ahead of its time again with some design. How did she miss that? Okay, that's what Zombie was talking about earlier. Cooking monsters and cannibals. <laughs> Wesky the culinary. Oh no. No, I don't want you. Don't use it. You're fucking mad. I already have like 15 saves. Just use the first aid spray and call my mama to pick me up. Looks like there's something there, but apparently not. I'll be back when I have more inventory slots. Good thing to know this is here. The good thing, Wesky, because I only beat it twice, I think, in my life. I started it four times total, but of those four times, finished it twice. Started on the Dreamcast, didn't finish it. Started on PS2, didn't finish it. Finished it on the GameCube once, some 12 years ago, and finished it on the Xbox 360 once, some seven years ago. Oh shit, is it spider time? Or is it... Respawning poison moth time, huh? Wait, oh there it is, okay, wait, before I do anything, I don't want to jump into some sort of trap, not poisoned, did I, can I open the box, did I even try, no, check, secure by a simple lock, okay, well your sister has a lockpick, so just keep it safe for now. There you go. Huh. Wait, we used it and it, he still has it. Ah. Take the paperweight. I, I called it. It's a double A family. They're all double A. Take the paperweight. Yes. Double A Industries. There's a file. Alfred's diary. Here we go. <clears throat> Just give me a second. I gotta do this properly. Uh, uh, um. January 30th. There's a sealed room in the hallway located inside of the Antarctic facility. I don't know what is hidden there, but I do know how to get in. <laughs> I can use the three jewels that each one of our three family members wear as proof of being a legitimate descendant of the Ashford family. Ah, the only problem is I do not know how I can gain possession of my father's proof. February 17th. I finally succeeded in entering that sealed room. <laughs> I never could have imagined that such an insane secret existed regarding the birth of both Alexia and myself. <laughs> I hate my father, that fool Alexander. Now, it is obvious that we were merely created in an attempt to cover my father's blunder. I can never trust him again. I must regain the glory of the Ashford family with my sister. I have nothing to be afraid of as long as Alexia is with me. March 3rd. Alexia carried out the experiment on the human body that we've been talking about. Our useless father must be happy now since he can finally contribute to the Ashford family. The only thing we should be careful about is that the butler, Harmon, does not become wise to our activities. Ah! April 22nd. I hope this diary is not long, man. <laughs> the experiment resulted in failure. 
Our father was useless after all. <laughs> Even worse, he turned into a dangerous monster that is completely out of control. We tied him down and locked him up in an underground prison cell. However, Alexia seems to be close to a solution. <laughs> Beyond all my expectations, she now says that she wishes to conduct the experiment on her own body. On top of that, she feels she must be kept asleep for 15 years in order to accomplish the experiment. Thanks to that idiot, I can't see my Dear Alexia, for as long as 15 years, Alexia is going to sleep with all her trust relying upon me. Now, I am the only one who can protect Alexia. <laughs> wow. Okay, so... <laughs> I missed a lot, sorry, I had to focus. You finished knife play in this game a long time ago. Yeah, I, I actually saw you play this one with knife. But I also learned the other day that zombies react weirdly to the knife in this game. If you uh, if you cut him in the, if you cut their legs, they they will fall down. I didn't know that. So we've been. I was just talking earlier to 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 people here, and uh, I'm gonna go for A S, maybe even S rank this year in this game. I love it. Alfred is so crazy. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> oh, you don't. If you need to squeak while read, you don't need to read slow. Yeah, I have to. That's how he talks. He talks fast and slow. Then he drags it. I'm going to enjoy this. That's how he says it. <laughs> Similar. So I don't know if you caught what happened there, sis, but. Uh, Alfred found out something about their creation, but uh, something else was there, an increment, yeah. He found something, <laughs> he found, I don't think he uh, flat out says it, right? The sealed room, yeah. So yeah, he found out about them, and he hates his fa father, so... They used their father for the experiment. He turned into a horrible monster that was locked down. So that Nosferatu, the boss we fought earlier with Claire and Steve, the last thing we did with them was um, was their father. And then we know Alexia experimented on herself and slept for 15 years. Well, she was supposed to sleep for 15 years. We don't know how how uh, how long it's been. Was it 17? Oh, yeah, it was. It was a very unlucky day for him, as you can see. <laughs> Anything else? No, but there's an herb here. Again, if it's one green and I got two, according to the promise I gave to my man Zombie... Oh, that's the one I left. I knew I was missing one. One here and per definitely missing one in, um, in the other... Um, in the first part. Alexander's Mammal. My father, Edward, he, uh, let's say he was, we never heard him, but let's say we're not going to do the Nosferatu voice, which is, we're just going to do the, the normal voice. My father, Edward, discovered the mother virus in cooperation with Lord Spencer, who was also a nobleman. They studied it for the purpose of military use. Eventually, their study took shape. They named a variation of the mother virus, the T-virus. The camouflage, to camouflage their research, they established Umbrella Chemical Inc. I majored in biogenetics and have been involved with a top secret project supporting my father's research. However, my research went through a difficult phase and my father died in the middle of the project. We are now at a major disadvantage against other researchers, as there is great competition in the field of T-virus research. I have disgraced the honorable name of the Asher family that our great ancestor Veronica established. If nothing is done, Umbrella will be taken over by Spencer. 
I must expedite the pro project to its fullest without being detected by Spencer. After much thought, I decided to establish a large-scale advanced research facility. It will be located in the transport terminal that I created by using the abandoned mine in the Antarctic. So, they probably got the mine from the thing. <laughs> Within the facility, I'll have a room built. It will be similar to the design of my mansion, the legacy of the late Trevor. I will be able to cherish my sweet memories there. So, it's actually the first mention of George Trevor before RE1 Remake. For security purposes, this confidential project will be given a code name. It is the name of the beautiful ancestor of the Ashwood family, Veronica, whom I wish to revive so badly. <clears throat> I am confident that the result of my research will be as glorious as her name and that honor will be restored to the Ashford family once again. That's the one. So that's a... Uh, let's see, I'm missing definitely one more. Yeah. So I'm missing one here. I don't know where it is and where I missed it. Between Memo to New Master and Alloy Report. Something with Chris, probably in the background that I missed. I missed one of the yellow ones. Between Secretary's Note and Newspaper Clip. And we're still missing... Yeah. So I'm missing one between Passage Memo and Alfred's Diary. And I don't know if the book goes all the way, so... That's why I practice. Paperweight. A tool used to hold documents so they don't scatter. I can't figure out the meaning of the design on its top. Its top? It's not apostrophe, Jesus. And bottom, but this item you seems to be related to umbrella ink. So, to its stop, it doesn't need an apostrophe because it's possessive, not uh, fucking. <laughs> it, it it's not a contraction of it is. It's it's possessive. Possessive? How do you say it in English? Pos possessive. Yeah, that's right. The z possessive, indicating it belonged to someone. Okay. So there's something about this. We got. Uh, so we have. Is that a spade? I guess. Spade, heart, joker, umbrella. Umbrella joker. <gasps> That's Alfred. And we have the biohazard logo. Alrighty, Wesky. Thanks again for the wonderful raid. Thanks for sticking around. And have a good night, my man. Thank you. I'll do my darnest best. So... Sure, but what about it? He doesn't want to comment on any of these. I think it's going to be a code for something later. Hello, zombie. Hello, zombie. Thank you, Wesky. Oh, that's, those are nice words. Okay, let's let's smoke another green weed. My shoulder hurts. There you go. Cured. <laughs> Look at all these grenades. Like who's going to shoot these grenades? And there's nothing underneath. Nothing there. Did I save though? Probably should. I have no idea what's coming after this. So I'm going to save every two seconds now. As I have no idea what's coming. And I won't, don't want to die stupidly and miserably. Wait. There's not going to be any more Bandersnatches. Are, are there? No Bandersnatch. But still 242 of these. I think it will be good. 14. There you go. Hi, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh. Three slots. I'm gonna bring the paperweight. I have no idea what it's gonna do. No, nope, don't unequip. Wait, what happens if I bring the lighter? The loiter.
What are you looking at? I don't like that look. Wait, I had more stuff upstairs. Should have done that first. A monster might have been the killer. Oh my god, Redfields. Just don't talk. Here we go. Ah. Ooh, that's nice. Nice cracking. Madame Pussy, would you kindly stop that? Just stop it. A bed. This is, appears to be the worker's lodgings. No, no, the thing on the bed. Come on, you blind man. Look, are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> stop it, kitty. That hurts. You got claws. We just stop. She gets carried away. And it's like, oh, you're bleeding. Why are you bleeding? Uh, there's nothing here but books. There you go, zombie. You were right. There was a an explosive. Uh, there was an explosive uh, grenade pack in the room. There was nothing else there, right? I think. There, ah, yeah, the valve. I need the valve for something. And everybody's gonna wanna kill me then when I do it. Is it showing me the a key item? Yeah. But it only shows key items apparently, not... <gasps> oh, wow. I was just joking. I didn't know you could actually do that. Look, there's a whole... There's a whole section. I guess we gotta put that in. No, wrong section. There's a whole section of the map that Claire didn't even see. Just take a shortcut. Whee! Look at me, ma. I'm ice skating. There's a control panel. Yeah, so we're gonna use all this. Nice. My god, what a competently man made game. A large man whose hands are tied hangs here. Is that Nosferatu? Did she freeze him? That's Nosferatu. That's. Old Alexander Ashford. Again. I don't remember the second battle. So I'm gonna be careful here. Zombie! I made an announcement earlier. Yeah. I tried... The D-pad is not really good. Well, it works, but yeah. I, I use analog sticks. I'm, I'm assuming all these guys are gonna get up as soon as they take the valve. Is it even? A, it's not even. It's not analog, so it doesn't matter. Look, it doesn't matter if I push it. If I push it lightly, or full, it goes the same speed. It's not. It's not. Um, it's not RE2 Nintendo 64 where it matters. You guys not gonna get up? You, I know you will get up at some point. Octaval. Not just get up, but probably get up with style. Yep, they're gonna get up with style. That makes no sense. They shouldn't be able to do that. Being dead and frozen. No one saying stars doesn't count. Oh, what the fuck was that? Yeah, I don't remember this. Oh. Two. Anymore? What a, what was that? They had a parasite of sort? Is that a baby albinoid? I have no memory of this. That makes it even scarier. Everyone dead? Everyone sleeping? Forever and ever and ever and ever? I would love that, guys. Thank you. And stay down. So I'm guessing I want to process the valve into something again, like 10 sided. Only here. Whoo! Yeah, I'm thinking he means troll face, Lubka. We do not have a troll face emoji, and we should. 
Hmm. Wah, 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 wah. Let's check that metalworking. Oh, metalworking device is busted. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what's not busted? This door that I've never been to. My arthritis is killing me again. The control panel for the crane. To operate the crane, I need a crane key. Is there any items? Are there any items around? Nothing. Nothing here. Oh, come on, Wesker. Are you serious? He's here? Even Chris got that. Oh, boy. Here we go. Don't get him, don't listen to him. Wow. Yeah, he asked why is why isn't there any? Aha, thank you, zombie. Nice hint. Nothing strange. There is nothing strange here, comrade hippie. Do not look anymore. There is nothing to see here. Move along. Hmm. Hasn't been used for quite a long time. So they just left the base? Ooh, that's bloody. Someone had an accident here, apparently. Oh my god, I'm beginning to remember. There's a switch. Do not push a random switch, Chris. That has never been good. Oh boy, there's an elevator? Very discouraging sounds. Look, there's a whole fucking... Wow, a whole new section. So, I see where I am, where Claire couldn't use the elevator, that's here. Which means I can pro- can I go back here? Tightly shut, okay. Amazing, so it's doing the same thing as in the first part of the game. What about the fire extinguisher? I never brought the fire extinguisher, I left it. I thought... Oh man, I thought I... I thought I won't need the fire extinguisher anymore, so I'd never brought it back. Right? Because you need to recharge the ex extinguisher. I thought I'd go back to the... God damn it, to the... Use fire bottle? What does he mean? Chemicals? I guess maybe it's not lost, but I doubt it. I think I... No magnum. Yeah, okay. Okay, well, that's just sad because, <laughs> you know, those two times that I beat, did beat the game a long time ago, I, I did this every time. But now, for some reason, I thought I would need to leave it there for Chris to pick up, but Chris never comes there. He never, oh, he never goes by to pick it up. You got to bring it with Claire and put it in the item box. All well, that's just sad. And I would have to recharge it here, right? There it is. Oh, okay, no magnum. Live and learn. It's an extinguish. It's an extinguishant. It should be used with the fire extinguisher. Well, no magnum, but we still have the AR. Hey, at least it'll stick with me now, zombie. <gasps> Is that where... Was Alfred here? It appears to be some kind of control panel. Some kind. There's a small square hollow. There's an audit. Notice. You can drain the water under the following conditions. One, to clean the tank. And two, to exchange the water. Okay, so I need to mix it with something. What, this? That's, that's not how it goes. Alright, so we've seen at least one bit of this. 
Nothing else? Nothing else? Wait, never forget the lighter. The lighter is your... There's another room that I haven't seen yet, remember now. At the end of the Disco Hunter corridor. That's amazing. There's a lot of replayability here if you're not a... Butthurt baby. Like some people were. I don't know who, but I heard. What, the, the valve? Let me try. It would be cool to just drop the whole fire extinguishant extinguish on in there. Yeah. What this? I tried to wait. Nah, it's not there. I'll need it somewhere. This is like this is like that time when we didn't get the marble quest in uh, Chrono Cross. It really hurt. Whoa! Is there another one? There is. Oh, why wouldn't there be another one? Ah, oh, fuck's sake! Where, where did you come from, boy? Does it hurt? I don't know if it hurts him underground, but we'll, let's find out. I know dogs have no iframes on the ground, but not sure about hunters. It's quite a long Resident Evil game, in a good way. It gives you a lot to work with. Okay, I hear a foot. Fuck that. Let's check the other room. Maybe there's something less scary there. How much of the map did I not... Alright, you gotta face your fears, man. Get out there and show them what you're made of. It's bullets. I'm made of bullets. Don't poison me. Oh yeah, okay, I forget, I just remember there's a whole new part here. When he said Man Trevor's Mansion, he actually meant Trevor's Mansion. Wow, what a long game, jeez. It never ends. Good. Keep treating me these, I'll keep using them. Stop my... Or try this. Oh. Well, very kind of you, game. Is he gonna respawn? That Because that would be really shitty. So what did poor Trevor, he designed all these mansions for these people and then just killed them. Huh. There's something in the water. Oh, there is something here. Okay. What is this then? Oh, those are wings. We're gonna make another of those dragonflies, huh? Let's dump some shit. I don't know where the first available item box is, so... What about that part, though? So, at least it shows key items. There's something across here, I'm gonna check where it goes, before entering the Potemkin village house. <laughs> That's what it is, right? Okay, guys. Let's finish this. Wow! Well, that was stupid. There you go. Back to arthritis. I knew there was 
less there and I still did it. Sir, I'm warning you. I got a lot of bullets. I saved a lot of them. Better be careful. Don't fuck with me. Is that a blue? That's a blue herb, I would say. Yeah, Did I kill them all? Wow. Better than Mickey Mouse. So this is where we get a lot of help. Now we see why Alfred is so weird. What he did in spare time. What a game. Like how did you make this back in 1999? Guys. Hasn't been used for quite a long time. It's locked. This should be open. This should open if power were to be supplied. Okay, at least you're literate, Chris. What's the warning? Danger, high voltage. High voltage. I am not afraid of electricity. Hello? Anybody home? Oh, nobody here, okay. Please be a... Oh yeah, safe room, yes! Let's stock up. Oh yeah, you don't you can't use that. Silly you. Okay, it's an electricity connecting device. There's a hollow in the shape of an octagon. Good, good. Exactly the kind I need. Oh, that's how it works. So what now? I can switch... Wait. I can switch the supply of electric power. But I guess I gotta push another button. Let's see what else can I do. Spec that up. Yeah, we're gonna be... Okay, we don't need the magnum. Look at all this shit, man. <laughs> 12 acid. 12 flame. 28 grenade rounds. Or burst rounds. Full assault rifle. Kalashnikov... Uh, Magazine and then another I guess 100% this is a long stack magazine. And this is a standard one 83% submachine guns. I Did get a knife in the end so we, and then shotgun then bow gun then pistol. Yeah, this is just chill. It's all gonna be good Hello kid. Welcome I take it you got your dinner and you're all happy What do you want? What do you want? Bra. Excellent. Yeah, she looks very satisfied. She looks like someone who's not torturing themselves with uh, with personal demons. She just ate. She's good. Oh, there's going to be a lot of double greens here. Good game, good. Take the blue as well. This isn't RE1 or RE2 or even RE3. So you got to stock up on these things. What else do I need to turn the power on? Also, is there a drawer in this desk? One... Man, you got lighter. What the fuck are you doing? There you go, we can see shit now. You could, but you don't... Oh, hell yeah. That's why we're doing this. See how easy it was to miss it without the lighter? Which is why the, the game was so hard before I played RE7. Literally, RE7, the first RE I liked a lot in years, made... Another RE that I didn't like a lot made it very likable. There is a switchboard off this floor. I guess four? Move the lever. Shoop. 
Is that does it is it on? So is it on or off? Do you need more evolving now? Well, this one. Well, if you played it on the emulator, you can get different results. It is a bit darker than the Dreamcast version, but I did test it the other day, remember? You still need the lighter to see. They didn't make it an illumination device for nothing. Now, if you're like Sasha and you boost up your brightness in games and uh, on your monitor, of course you don't need the lighter. But the idea was to need it. W what's the on position? I'm just going to move it and hope for the best. What's the point of that? Let's check outside before I do anything else. There were more herbs there. I'll be back. Greetings, everybody. And hello, annoying Peter from... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I don't know what those are. <laughs> Only you can see them. It's, it's your own world, Carter. How are you doing, man? I did, but... I think the power's on. It looks like the power's on. Wait, we'll see. You know how, how we're gonna find out? Map? Yep. The power's on. The thing's yellow. Let's save, because I have no idea what's waiting on the other side of the door. The abundance of blue herbs is a little concerning. So, I really want to finish this game tonight. Is it possible, zombie, to finish it within an hour? hour and a half if not yeah that's okay but it would be lovely if it were oh that was pointless there are no bender snatches so i'm just gonna drop this for now mind you for now it's not forever still don't know what's waiting explosive uh, explosive arrows then a shotgun then shells yeah <laughs> <laughs> you should make your own ads on Twitch, man. What did I say I want to do? I want to save. Yeah, it hurts me to, to save this much. But I already told myself, forgive yourself. You're learning. You don't know this game. You even suck at it. So just do it like that. There you go. Okay, not at the same point but still better than last time no that's not better than last time that's the final so originally wow yeah that means originally originally 2014 i beat it with 15 save with you speed yeah i'm gonna go for a rank in this game that's my how much i like it we're gonna go for a actually i'm gonna go for s rank fuck the a rank just, just, just jump there i'm gonna play it a lot Here we are. But why am I here? Ah. Is it locked from the other side? Familiar maybe, Lupka? Does this look familiar? That note did say Trevor made another mansion for them. Before they killed them, you know. Because that's what they do. But this is more like a Potemkin village ma a mansion. Meaning it's not real. It appears to be a protective suit. Hmm. Oh, don't take it yet. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Ah, I didn't want to go there. No clue. Fuck, that's not what I wanted to do. Can I go back, please? I did save. If something goes wrong, I'll just load it. Load the game. Hey, what is that slithering sound? Oh fuck, look at that. 
Are they weak to this? Are they hornets? Are they... Oh, I forgot all about this. They're hornets. Of course they're hornets. It's Resident Evil. Scary fuckers. Ants. Well, yeah, ants and hornets are pretty much relatives. Oh, do they poison? I'm gonna bet my sweet ass they do poison. Can I clear the way? Yeah, I can, I guess. Yeah, of course they're ants. Bees? I mean, okay. But more like hornets or wasps. Wasps and ants are pretty close relatives. So before going here, follow the blue. I want to get all those uh, dragonfly parts that I missed before. And see if I can go back to the main hall of the mansion. But I'm following the blood where Alfred went to meet his sister, am I? Do I want to take the jewels? I feel like if I take the jewels I'll be... Oh, it has to be the map. A woman drawing water. So you've seen this, Chris. You've been here. Picture of beautiful scenery. Picture that gives a dark impression. There's nothing strange about it. Picture of a chubby woman. Well, we know it's a man now, thanks to David. There's nothing strange. A beautiful old painting. So how the fuck do I even... How do I push this onto that? Can't climb it. I guess I'll push something else. Lock the biohazard symbol is carved by the keyhole. Okay. Need to turn power on, okay? For the for the dragonfly thingy? Or for the jewels? Are they family jewels? Yeah, this is where I left them. Let's 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 see what's in here. So there's one. Yeah, we found them. They're on the map, right? Yeah, there they are. Tiger head, okay. Oh yeah, there's power. There you go. We did get power, at least some of the power. Another wing object. I think we need four of them to make uh, to make a dragonfly or an ant, either. Because they have two pairs of wings, I think. Oh, okay, that's what you mean. Sorry, zombie. I need more words, otherwise I I keep doing stuff. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, exactly. It takes some time. Uh, takes some time, but we've been playing Outbreak for two years, so I I learned to communicate. With minimal words or sometimes even with ad-libs sometimes we just communicate with ad-libs zombie says you know an outbreak go come thank you no yes i know exactly what he means it's like it's like a, a, a unique version of the morse code hello there <gasps> it's clear she has fainted inside the cocoon. I need some kind of tool to open it. You have a lighter? You have a knife? Sometimes we complete each other's thoughts without ever saying a word. <laughs> exactly, yeah. What I love about Zombie is I always know where I stand with him. He'll never pretend to be, like, pretend to be, not nice, but, you know, pretend everything's okay or, like, whatever's on his mind, I know. So that way, you know, I don't have to, we don't have to play a guessing game. Yeah, I would think a knife. But is it too early to set her free? It's a picture of twins and their father. Three weird holes open. And they're at the boy's finger. The man's ear. And the 
The man's ear and the girl's bosom. Okay. And these. Nope. Have you sp spanned my server with photos of your canned goods? Nope. I, at least I wasn't home all day, so if you did it earlier, I wasn't there to see it. Canned goods. Mmm. Well, that's very nice of the game. I shouldn't have picked it up, but I did. The yeah. end. It's locked. Ah, oh, so I took the knife for nothing, huh? Claire, my sister, let me release you. Oh, they're the, they're all the same knife. So, again, you can do things whichever order you like sometimes in this game. It's still, I love it. Claire. Food channel. <laughs> Just put it in real life. Chris. I will make one, though. You're not the first person who mentioned it. You so much. I know. But we have to get out of here. Not yet. We have to find Steve. Who's Steve? Who the fuck is Steve? From that island with me. But then a monster attacked us and we got separated. So that means Steve is still somewhere in this base? I'm sure of it. Claire? Huh. What's wrong? I think... I think I've been poisoned. Just hold on. I'll be right back. You were pretty much poisoned. And somehow still alive. So she's just gonna hang in there, huh? Claire is poisoned. I need serum. Well. Old Trevor's legacy isn't for nothing. That's everywhere. Everything in this place, okay? Now I need to p move everything in inventory. I could have just gone back for the knife. I'm gonna guess another one of these is somewhere else. Where did the elevator come from? Well, look at all those rooms we haven't explored. There's That's a lot of rooms, man. No joke. Been there, done that, explored that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> That's not okay. I thought it was one of those hunter things. <laughs> Zombie, which outbreak character has the whiniest and poisoned ad lib? Here we go. Oh, I hate when it does that. Bloop, 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 bloop. There you go. I'm, gonna, I'm carrying all this shit not knowing whether I'll need it or not. So, if I take those two... Ah, just go. In and out, in and out. What's Cindy? Cindy's. Um, I've been poisoned. Well, this is something. I'm poisoned, you dick. She doesn't say that literally, but something like that. So let's check that tiger again. Oh, good. Green, green nose powder. How could you? How do I get the map? It's eating me. What was a waste of herb? I don't I don't know what you're talking about it. What you talking about? What the hell is you talking about? Let's take the blue one. Okay. Seems to work by electric power, okay? 
Take the socket. Yes. So I'll need to turn the power off. I see what I need to do. I need to get it stuck somehow. I'm gonna make the ants, am I? The queen, king and queen. Well, we don't need it because I missed out on the magnum. Suck it. So they had a four-sided, a square-shaped, uh, square, no, square valve that we trimmed down to octavalve octagonal so we trimmed its edges to get get it to octagonal but then we found a socket that turns it back into square only in this game you gotta love this shit socket this appears to be some kind of socket <laughs> you can suck it okay there you go zombie you were right octa shaped valve with a square socket <laughs> in other words a transformer Okay, I know what I need to do. So I need to... Um... Ah, oh, yes, yes. I see what you're saying about... No, it's not. <laughs> it's not wasteful because there's no not enough... I was talking about this the other day. That's a strategy I started using recently with... I think RE1... Uh, replace. I realized there's always less uh, green herbs than red ones. Now in outbreak, that would be true because in outbreak, uh, because of the, because there's so many different characters, all the all the health items except for first aid sprays restore a set a set amount of HP. But in all the previous games, including this one. Green is 25%, two green is 50%, and red green is uh, 100%, as is three greens. So, since I found about 50 green herbs, but only five red ones, not five, maybe 10, that's what I've been doing. It saves a lot of storage space. Because normally when I finish these games, especially RE1, especially RE1 Remake, I have no more room in the box for the health items. <laughs> I have, like, literally, I was out of room, and Sasha was, <laughs> Sasha was teasing me. <laughs> Are you sure you don't need maybe some other herbs there? You know, I know the chest is overflowing. You might need some other ones. So that's how I came by that strategy. And it works. It works great. Still protective suits. <laughs> crack in the floor. It's cracked. Well, sure. <gasps> <laughs> oh man uh, Carter just cracked this wall uh, cracked this floor uh, I know it's something like this wait he says no walking you didn't say anything about running <laughs> it's gotta be the paperweight <laughs> Carter Carter wins this stream I thought it's got something to do with paperweight, but apparently I was wrong. We'll have to push something on it, I bet. <laughs> oh, it's cracked. It's cracked. It's cracked so bad. <laughs> I give up, man. What the fuck? Yeah, it's cracked. Sure. Do I have to I have to stick something in it, right? Do I have to stick wings in it? Man, we, we're at the classic RE game where I have no idea what to do next. There's a map here teasing me. <laughs> There's a crack in the floor. There's a paperweight, but none of this is helpful. <laughs> I, I know, I gotta go use the valve. I'm pretty sure. <sighs> it's pushed the statues. Thank you, zombie. <laughs> <laughs> true that, true that. Which is why there's a full chest of herbs, which is how we got to the hole. Oh my god, oh, come on. You know, when I would think of that zombie, I would be here for next five episodes and ask what to do. Thank you, man. You, this really helped. <laughs> uh, did I push it? Did I over push? Nah, it'll be good. It'll be fine. 
And I'll get the map that way, am I? Bravo, zombie. Now that's... That's really good. You got the map. You got the map of a dark dick transport terminal. So we haven't been there. One of those is the final boss room. We gotta turn the power off. So that's what I gotta do now. I gotta turn the power off. And get both gems out of there. Holy shit, look at that. <laughs> yep. Uh, what was I doing? I'm having fun. This is what streaming is all about. <laughs> you forget about the game. You laugh your ass off. <laughs> Wait, there was a door behind that. Was there? Did I... <clears throat> uh... There was the elevator door that takes me to the... Okay, okay. What do I want to do now? I got all this shit. Well, you know what? Carry on with all this shit. <laughs> Carter and zombie. Guys, thank you. <laughs> Armory. Wait, the, the valve. I forgot about the valve again. I was going to use it. Where was I gonna use it? The... Uh, 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 uh. Huh. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm getting... So that's the thing, because you can, you can, you can do things... You can do objectives in whichever order you want to. That's why I'm getting confused. It's, it's the least linear classic Resident Evil. Aside from Outbreak again, where, you know, multiple players can tackle... Yes, thank you, zombie. Can tackle multiple objectives. This is... Like, if this was made co-op, if this is ever remade, I really... Someone will kill me. Hope it will be ki kind of a co-op. Because it would be cool to tackle the objectives with another player. Yeah, I can turn the power off, get the jewels and come back, right? Because if I do that... Like, I can perfectly... Oh, no, the door is electric. Never mind. I'll go to use the valve. Shut up. Use the valve. Shut up and use the valve. <laughs> what is this? That is contrabass. <laughs> I heard that one. I heard a lot of that one from older workers. I guess he didn't find me. So to the water tank, it's... Now I turn right, then I turn left, and it's right there. So you don't really have iframes, you're just pretending. He was at the door. I w otherwise, I would have gladly ra ran, but he was right at that door. That's okay, look at all this ammo. I gotta spend it on something. Okay, so we're gonna turn on the other power. No, we're not. We're gonna drain this thing. There we go. I get why the why these why these RE games became more simple after Code Veronica and Outbreak. So they put so much time and manpower in these two games. That weren't that didn't do nearly as good as the simpler ones. So of course, it was easier to play. Oh, no, ah, of course, you gonna poison me?
It works actually. Cool. Speaking of silver, staying silent is gold. Well, not silver, more like the opposite. <laughs> uh, of course. Oh boy. Can you go through the glass? No. That hunter knew exactly where to come. Can I take the valve now? Oh, it's gone forever. Goodbye, valve. You've been a good comrade. Well, I have to go now. Me and my spas shotgun. So what if I ran? Would he follow me through this, I wonder? So now that I got the crane key, I got a, uh, I got a Antho Nosferatu. Crane key, it's a key, it's an activation key used to operate a crane, that's correct. You know that song, Silence is Golden? One may argue that saying silent wasn't a good. <laughs> uh, armory, yes. Wait, armory? Where, where is the armory? <gasps> I have to help Claire to help Steve, right? Because if I don't help Claire, I'm not going to help Steve. Something like that? I don't know what, what he meant by save Steve. Hold on, hold on, armory. Here, lift. He says, here, lift. Okay. <gasps> downstairs, downstairs. Yeah, the chemicals. There you go. There. Oh, kitty, stop that. She's walking all over my family jewels. Stop it. Yeah. I guess we have some heads to pop. Wow, it's so easy to decapitate in this game. Right, so it's here. Ah, now we can take it. Bravo, zombie. So what if you if you don't um, if you don't heal Claire? Does that mean you never do the part with her? Watch out, serum medicine that will help against special poison. So we made poison and we made serum because we knew we we're gonna get it like this. I can't read that shit. Wow, how much I've forgotten. You know the song, Looking Back Over My Shoulder? Looking back over my shoulder? Sounds like a country song. I was looking back around my shoulder. Not around, <laughs> over my shoulder. Kind of sounds like a Credence Clearwater Revival song. Two, 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 looking back over my shoulder. Did we use that elevator? Oh, that's where I came from, right? B5F. Jesus Christ almighty. So right next to me is this big door. You Are you sure? Am I going to fight the boss, zombie? Just one question. Am I going to... Fight the zombie, the the boss. Am I gonna fight him? That's the only question. Well, even if I do, I'm just gonna run there. No, okay. I'm just gonna run. Try to see. I'm gonna try to go undetected. I don't know if it's possible to run as fast, but I will certainly try. Why am I talking like this? I am having fun. <gasps> That never stops being here. It's scary. I can have seven fucking hundred bullets and rockets. They're still poisonous disco hunters. Who could have done this? <clears throat> so that's that's one of the one of the family proofs. Remember when I asked about this? <laughs> There she is. Alexia. That is how I dispose of insignificant bugs, said the spider to the fly. How do you wish to die? <laughs> 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 
Fuck, zombie. Why did you do this to me, man? I thought you were my friend. Oh. Do we have to fight it? I'm gonna try not fighting it. <laughs> Why does it have to be giant fucking spiders? Uh, ooh. God, look how big the thing is. Oh, my, my arthritis is working up. Let's just caution. Good. Hello, Gavin. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Woo! <laughs> ah, many ways to die in this game. Many ways. How are you doing, Gavin? Oh, you know the song, okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna leave it. Lots of sex. Death by Snoo Snoo. <laughs> mm, let's check the map. So I, I'm just gonna go here. Wait, no, I need the, I need the fucking ear, earring. I need the earring. Uh. Oh, he's spitting poison everywhere. Alexander's peers. I said I read peace. Wonderful. That's what I like to hear. How are you doing out of a hundred? <laughs> Ooh. Let's see what Alexander's peace can do. Check. Appears to be. It appears the jewel portion can be removed. Take the jewel. Yeah, while the spider is staring at me, I'm just gonna take. The metal portion has been removed and you're, you've obtained the Alexander's jewel. Wink, wink. <laughs> All right, now we, that we have Alexander's jewel, I think we gotta combine it with... Can be attached to a pierce. Yeah, I think we gotta combine it with this, right? No, that's not it, something else. Come here, tall, dark, and ugly. I might be running towards it. Oh no, that was perfect. I tricked an insect. I feel smart. I will, Dupka. I will. <laughs> I'm about to heal, but let me see. Such a classic game, one of the hardest, particularly battle mode. I used to think that the same thing. Uh... Gavin, so I was saying earlier, third time, but what can you do? No, not everyone can be here at the same time. <clears throat> I thought of this game, same thing as I thought about Outbreak, that it's weird and that it's difficult and why the fuck did they make it? But playing it now, after playing RE7 and learning to use this as a source of light and not just a key item, and then finding way more ammo and health that I completely missed on my first two playthroughs, because I only beat this game twice. This is the one RE that I beat the, the least times. I think I beat it the same times as RE7. <laughs> that is way younger. So I had a lot of fun in this playthrough. Playing it differently. Looking at it differently, you know, as an adult. Honestly, right now, I'm going to say RE3 is the most difficult one for me. The original. If you play it on hard mode. Because it's so easy to die. Look at all this shit I have. I wasn't even conserving as much as I thought. Because it's a stream, you know. I didn't want to reload my save every two seconds. Well, what am I doing? I gotta go save Claire, right? The the thing is there. So let's check the map. Where am I? Where am I? I am here. I have to go somewhere else. <laughs> uh, sodium levels are rising steadily. Will I make it? Never. Oh. Well, as soon as you do your objective, they're gone. Very picky traps. So that would take me there, right? There. Which elevator goes where? For the love of fuck. That one goes there, then that one goes even deeper. So now... Thank you for all the laughs, Carter. Thank you for the laughs. <laughs> Thank you for hanging out with us, man. You have a wonderful evening yourself. <sighs> think, think, think. Cure Claire? You know what? Let's go cure Claire. That sounds like the first logical thing to do. And cure myself because we get that heal, redeem. We're just going to do it logical. What an amazing game. It's true. I get it now why people are clamoring for mostly for the remakes of Code Veronica and Outbreak. 
They were too good for their time. And they were too good for the kids we were when we played this. At least in my case, you know. I hope somebody somewhere hears this. They do res deserve... If not a... If not, not even a remake, just remaster them, up them to, you know, modern. Code Veronica kind of got it. I guess you could tweak it a bit more, but... Three, huh? Here we go, Lupka. Chris smoked a marijuana plant and cured his arthritis. He's back in shape. But that plant is also the reason why he keeps wearing his stars uniform. He forgot that he's not in stars anymore. So this is where we'll turn the power off. But if I do that, let's check actually. I guess we gotta find another way to get there. And that's why we need the biohazard card. Cause see, I get it. This door is now locked, so I can't get there. But once I get the biohazard card, I will be able to go from the main hall to the gallery. That's, so I'm looking for that now. Yes, cause it works for me. At least I started, so the idea, uh, Gavin, was to stream the, uh, so don't heal her right away, right? Uh, we were supposed to stream the Dreamcast version, but there was an issue with disc one, so this had to step in. And I started it on Xbox One, but when it loads particles from light, and when it loads some cutscenes, it just start goes, uh, 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 stutters a lot. And that's why I switched to an actual 360. I had to dust it off. It was still packed from the move last year. But it works amazingly well. So, David, zombie. Cure, um, cure Claire or do something else. I don't know what else I can do. Let's save again. Because I have no idea what I'm doing here. <laughs> I'll have to fight Veronica. Is it when she's like on crack running around? Trying to end me? I gotta drop some of these things, man. I have no idea why I'm carrying this. So we're going into a boss battle, he says. Okay. So we're gonna fight Veronica on... Wait, Veronica? Alexia. Why do I keep saying Veronica? Yeah, I know why I'm saying that. So we have one, two, three, four, five. And then I brought three doubled. In case things go horribly wrong. Let's bring some... What do you think? Shotgun? SMG or the Kalashnikov uh, assault rifle, AK-47? Oh yeah, I do need uh, this. How else am I gonna cure her, huh? We will, yes, we will. Uh, no, I used them on, that, on those disco hunters. I thought, you know, with all this arsenal, because the grenade launcher is with Claire. What do you mean do the cube? I got lost with that. I tried, but I don't get what to do. So, check. Tool used to hold documents. Can't figure out the main meaning of the design on its top and bottom, but this item seems to be related to Umbrella Inc. Same text. You hippie. <laughs> yep. So it is a puzzle. Huh. I thought it's a key item I'll have to use somewhere. Can you spin it? No, you can't spin it like that. The Joker? Is that like Alfred is the Joker? Alexia is biohazard? The biohazard key. Is that is that the key? Oh my god, that's the key, is it? <laughs> Let's see. I have no idea what I'm doing, so... Let's be safe. Just keep it there. I don't know if you heard that, David. I was talking about it earlier, but... I decided to do with this game what I did with Outbreak. 100%ed, <clears throat> master it, S rank it, no damage, <laughs> no item, no weapon, whatever. <clears throat> That's not it. Ok, 
Okay, then let's bring the. <clears throat> well, I'm gonna try. Hold on, I gotta cough real bad. As you can hear. Uh... Wow. I mean, wow. So it is a keyhole, huh? I don't know what to do with it. I don't know what to do with it. There's, there's a couple of rooms I didn't check downstairs. Maybe bring the cube down there. More info. Buddy boy, I need more info. Remember, I am I'm blind here. <clears throat> okay, okay, okay. So it's the room. I'm not looking. <laughs> it is what I thought. It is the rooms that I missed downstairs. Okay. It's the big elevator, which is... Okay, I see where it is. Yeah. <clears throat> well, let's not fight Alexia just yet, then. <clears throat> I'll drop this. I'm, I'm ta I take it it's not the point. I don't, don't want to fight her just yet. <clears throat> you okay throat what's wrong with you <clears throat> feels like i was in a nightclub all night i get it i get it no i, I got you going guys okay okay <laughs> first i asked no one's replying and then i can't get them to break <laughs> i am grateful though so i'm gonna bring these and this i feel like i'll need them and i'm gonna leave one of these doubles as well <laughs> yeah pro it's probably the, the same room the command room <clears throat> so th it is the two rooms i haven't checked downstairs because there's a lot of bugs is it yeah it's was it here yeah it was there and then down the elevator that's right Aha. Uh -huh. Do the little fuckers poison? And does this cure poison if you uh Wait, if I is it like with Richard? What it happens if I don't bring blood to Claire on time? Will she just expire? No more Claire? You get bad ending? I'll kill you all. I have enough bullets for everyone. I guess they're just a nuisance. So there are two rooms. Let's go to the one on the left first. Ow. 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 Ooh, nice herb. Would be a shame if... Rare? What the fuck is that? I can't see shit. Oh, It looks like a hunter. In the wall. Okay, I guess we gotta do this the old fashioned way. I repeat, mission code double X is complete. Oh, uh, do I wanna go there? Nah, I don't wanna go there. What am I, crazy? More greens, but blue, a file. Research report on Queen Ant. <clears throat> I really hope this is, wasn't Alfred. I can't keep doing the voice with this throat. <laughs> After discovering the remains of an ancient virus within the genes of a Queen Ant, I have been concentrating on the research of ants. You know, this actually makes sense. It makes sense the most of the plot of this game. Because uh, the, the scientists did do that. They did find traces of ancient viruses in our genes, not just like ants and shit like that. And... Uh, there are changes in the DNA, because we know our last common ancestor. There are changes in the DNA that can only be explained by some 
way back infections that were carried over to, you know, edit out our genes in a way that you can see the consequences of that. But then connect that to that fungus <laughs> that uh, eats the ant's brain and makes them into zombie ants, and you got yourself another Resident Evil game. The ecosystem of the ant seems truly ideal to me. There is one ant, queen ant, in each ant hill, and the soldier and worker ants are the queen's slaves. They dedicate their lives to the queen. The death of the queen ant means the doom of the entire ant hill. However, the soldiers and worker ants can be easily replaced as long as the queen ant is alive. This is exactly the same relationship between myself and the other ignorant masses. Oh, that's Edward, I guess. I have succeeded in creating an ideal virus by implanting the queen ant's gene into the mother virus that Spencer found. I use my otherwise useless father. Oh, no, that's all oh, God. <clears throat> <clears throat> I used my otherwise useless father as a test subject. However, as I expected, the virus caused a rapid change in his cells, triggering the complete destruction of his brain cells and body flesh. Furthermore, how many pages to... Oh, okay, oh, that's Alexia. Furthermore, a special type of poison gas was generated inside his body that the blue herb had no effect against. Yikes! Because of this, I created an antidote in, the ca in, case, of, in, in, case, in, in case of emergency and stored it inside of the weapon chemical warehouse on the B2 floor. Okay, that would have told me. I have decided to name this virus with unimaginable potential the T. Veronica virus. When I find out how I can utilize the power of this wonderful virus, my great research will finally be complete. Alexia Ashford. So we finally hear from her. Is it like showing me? Yeah, it's showing me where it would have been had I not found it. Okay, so I cheated a little, I guess. Let's see what else is there before doing anything. Oh, we're gonna fight in the dark later. Are we? What, what the fuck? <laughs> not, not even later, just like right now. What made them get up now? I can do this. You've been with zombies before. Oh, he's dead. You're dead, Jim. Look at that pile. Okay, there's a queen ant, I guess. Computer terminal. It must have been hooked to a supercomputer. Supercomputer. Ha! Huh. Invisible ammo. Very tight. The queen ant is dead. The ant hill seems to have perished. Wow, that's a queen ant? What is that, like a fucking mutant? Look at that thing. So they are ants. Because as far as I remember, ants have wings until they mate. Once, once, once they mate, they drop their wings and they stop. Because people would sometimes say flying ant. And from what I heard, I'm not, I can't guarantee this, every ant is flying until... Ah... Um, uh, <laughs> uh, after I did everything, right? So what was the point of that? Does it really help? Nope, it does not. I don't get it. What was the point of that? So you can see the zombies without... He's not gonna talk about it, okay? I'm not gonna talk about anything either. You wanna do it that way? Suit yourself. Can I push it? Can I bring it home? I guess not. 
It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of Ashford family Veronica. Oh wow. Cause I'm trying to figure out what's with the lamp. Hmm. I guess nothing. Hello there, Herb. Hey, good to see you. Really happy to see you. So it's just there to give light, I guess, so you wouldn't have to. Ow! Every fifth one stings. Oh boy. Damn, just open the door and the suspense is killing me. Slowly. Aha, uh -huh. the command center. There we go. It appears that everyone else who's better at this game than me was right. Who would have thought? So there's really nothing to see. Nothing to see here. Virus research report. I'm not gonna use voices. Getting tired. Work continues. I lied. Work continues on the T. Veronica virus, which I extracted from the Queen Ant. The more research I conduct on it, the more I am impressed by how much potential it has. I have finally implanted the virus into my own body and discovered how to utilize its power. I will avoid making the mistake that I made on my father. I will suppress the activity of the virus at an ultra-low temperature, so that my cells will change slowly. My calculations indicate that it will take 15 years before my body will gain immunity and become able to coexist with the virus. Until then, I have no choice but to trust the capsule that I will be in, to that inept but loyal soldier who is my brother. For me to obtain unlimited power, some risks need to be taken. When I awaken, I will be the queen, and the T. Veronica virus will be unleashed upon the entire world by my children. Every lost creature on earth will exist to serve me. At that time, the world will achieve the perfect ecosystem, just like the anthill, but on a much grander scale. Alexia Ashford. Hello? Do we get channel 3 here? Can I watch some Ninja Turtles? No? You guys are no fun. It's weird. I don't remember any of this until I see it. And then it all comes back. Something is written on it. As... <clears throat> As twins, Alexia and I are two sides of a coin. A design is carved under the name of Alexia. So, heart, spade, double A, crown. Uh, heart, spade, A, A, crown. Oh, wait. Did I fuck something up? Nope. I've been typing on nothing. Okay. Heart, spade, double A, crown. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. There's a button with a design. Don't push it yet. I want to check what is happening. Yeah, you'll find out why. You'll find out why she's like that. Jeez, what did I do? Okay, I can see myself. Nothing there. Well, I guess they push the button. Push it. Two sides of the same cl crown. A uh, clown? Clown. <laughs> so it was heart spade. <clears throat> heart spade. Double A crown. So it has to be two sides of the same coin. Let's just go backwards. Crown. Double A. Spade. Heart. There's no response. Hmm. Two sides of this. Ah, I get it. That's why I need the cube. Okay, okay, I see now. Check. So, 
Heart becomes, I gotta write this now, heart becomes double A. So heart becomes, let's say, top, 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 so I know what I'm doing, double A. Spade becomes crown. Then um, double A becomes, well, the opposite, heart, right? Double A becomes heart. And then, and then finally, crown becomes spade. So if I did this right, I should have the, I should have the answer for you, teacher, in a minute. Okay, so what did I write down? Double A, <clears throat> double A, then uh, double A, then crown, then heart, and then what the fuck is A? Uh, spade, I meant S. There you go. Nice. Nailed it. It appears I should put something in there. Don't look, everyone. I'm sorry. Chris has got to do something here. Hold on a moment. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I mean, it was perfect height. He said, I got to put something in it and like it's it's right there. <laughs> All right, we got Alfred's ring, so we just need Alexia's proof. <laughs> I'm proud of that gag. That was that was one of my favorite gags since I started streaming. Period. <laughs> uh, okay, done. See, I told you it was easy, guys. <laughs> uh, yes, Kitty, welcome, welcome to Comedy Club. <laughs> We're having fun here, Kitty. You wanna have fun? Okay, then let's go battle the mistress. The double A mistress. Man, they should have started like a battery company with that with those initials. Hello? Okay, it's time to do the power. To do the power. I need the all the power. It's bread slapping time. Gavin, so you like Code Veronica, right? Sorry, I forgot to ask. I get lost in these games. Yeah, we're so close, Lupka. Very close. I was I was doubtful, but now I am 100% sure it'll, it will be done. So they talked about three proofs. Let's just dump everything that's not Claire saving stuff. I'll check Alfred's ring. Let's dump the weed. There you go. Cold Veronica is very long. I did say that. Cold Veronica is pretty long. And then RE4. Cold Veronica is fun long. RE4 is just painful raw, painful long. It appears the jewel portion can be removed. Take the jewel. The metal portion has been removed. And you've obtained the Alfred jewel. Okay, Alfred's jewel. A blue jewel that has been attached to Alfred's ring. Alright. Nice. We're collecting jewels here. Family jewels. Duke Nukem strikes from the grave. She got that. My wife got that. I'm very proud of her. Don't do not do the Alfred. That's my bet. You don't get to do the Alfred. <laughs> so, let's see how we're standing with weed. One, two, three, four, one, two, and then three in my pocket, and then three here, and then okay, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. Yeah, I don't have the key, but I'm gonna I'm gonna do some bitch slapping here. I'm glad I'm glad you like it, Gavin. I really do. I really do. I really am. <laughs> oh man, I'm gone, but I'm doing this. Fuck everything. Five episodes is enough for a Resident Evil game. 
We're gonna bring the Kalashnikov. Yeah, we're, I'm bringing the Kalashnikov. I'm just gonna... I'm, fuck the pistol. I, I bet it's not gonna be helpful for Alexia. For Alexia! I'll bring that, and I'll bring the submachine guns. Nah, I'll leave them for when there's like too many things. And then save. There. Lighter is not gonna kill Alexia, so I'm gonna start with this right away. Ant base. I still, I can't, that's still. <laughs> Save all for jewels. <laughs> it's it it is kind of funny that it's that it spells ant base. Okay, we're gonna have Alexia on crack. I'm not gonna bring the other clip. I will save something for the last boss. Final boss. But it'll be good. I have high hopes. <laughs> I have high hopes. Because <laughs> his pockets are full of weed. He's gonna make it. Wait, where? I gotta get to the... Oh yeah, that's it's that way. Oh, stop that. I wanna get out. I want out of here. Yeah, that's, that's where I want to be. I'm coming, Claire. I'm coming, my dear sister, Claire. Oh, that, the, the fucking... <laughs> the horses scared me. Oh, there we go. Claire. Claire, I have a serum. Pa -pa 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 -pa. <laughs> Feeling better? Thanks to you. Just like a big brother, huh? You're always looking out for your little sister. <laughs> it's oh, she's cackling again. Alexia, there really is an Alexia? <laughs> yeah, you've been sleeping. Yeah, she doesn't know. It's almost time, you genetically inferior siblings. <laughs> After her. Did you say inevitably inferior? What the fuck? Wait, memory's coming back. Looks like an armadillo. Wait, love, did she really say inevitably inferior siblings? What kind of sentence is that? <laughs> inevitably inferior. What we what do we say? Jeez, what's Just going go. on there? I'll be fine. Oh I no, can't. he's got the best weapons. I, save Steve. Go. I just saved. I just saved. I'm sorry, I gotta go back. Oh, so give him nothing then. Or maybe... Do I want to give him nothing? Let's try. Let's see where this goes. Oh. Damn, you're in danger? Let's fix that. Whoop. She does have a bazooka. Man, he's got all the stuff. Do I want to drop it in the... I guess I want to drop it in the... Box. Box! We need another box. If we're gonna save... Oh, jeez. So, once you know what you're doing here, on your second playthrough or so, you really gotta think about what you wanna... What you wanna do first, where you wanna go... Is Chris fighting Alexia? Is... Is... Who's fighting Alexia? I gotta... Ah, uh, again, memory rushing back. Where was that? Then... Bullets, then... Sh right? Bullets, shotgun, shells. Then AK rounds, uh, all of this shit. Well, let's get these. That's, that's her shotgun. Let's say that's her shotgun. Instead of these, I'll bring flame rounds. Still, that's... I could use some more ammo for the pistol. No, okay. If you say no love, then it's a no. No. Oh, there is ammo. I left everything from Chris. There you go. 
There you go, he can keep the shotgun and the AR. Thank you, Chris. You did something right, man. But no lighters, so I have no idea where the items are now. I can't see shit. Oh. I wonder if there's something behind that painting. It looks like there's really, really, really nothing here, but I'm gonna try pushing it anyway. Anyway? What do you mean, anyway? Okay, that's the wrong game. But I guess it calls for more Silent Hill games. Yeah, I'm gonna go all the way, see what happens. Oh, so I need to put the shotgun there. Why? What would happen if I put the shotgun there? More Spencer Mansion? Yeah. It's like like a reshuffled Spencer Mansion. Ujibalula! Oh, just ammo. Okay. Go back to your hole. Oh, there is something there. I see it. I found it. I found it. Freeze. Fish police police station. You think that's a good idea, David? What, what about her, though? He does have the shotgun and the AR. Are those not good enough for you? Well then, if it's like that, then let's do this properly. At least it's, it's so easy to do this here. Okay. So he doesn't need anything. <clears throat> He's not gonna do shit there. They, the game wouldn't let me get to a boss room without, you know, anything. So there you go. Everything goes to Claire. We're gonna do a naked Chris. Naked Chris. -y. Yeah, I'll open the case with her. You're right. You're completely right. That's all. Naked Chrissy into action. He's got a lighter. That's all he needs. They can sense her and now he can light his cigarettes whenever he wants. There you go. <laughs> I guess he can go in with a lighter. I'm looking for my sister. I can't see shit. Wait. Oh, you think? You think not even pistol? Fuck the pistol. He does. Okay, I'll bring his pistol. It is. It. What? That's not. That's not Serbish. <clears throat> it is his pistol, so I will bring it with me. There you go. What do you mean, zombie? I I left everything for Claire. Hold on, hold on, guys. The game wouldn't let me just go in there, overwrite my save, and lock myself in a boss battle without anything, right? It doesn't make sense. I mean, it doesn't make sense. Why would it... Like, imagine saving and you're locked in, in, in a boss room without any weapons. That makes no sense. Doesn't? Please, someone give me words of consolation. I guess I'll bring the AR. With Chris. Well, it was too good to be true. <laughs> Fuck you, here's a grenade. I'll bring this then. Claire's got a lot of ammo. Wait, he said grenade launcher. But that's with Claire. He said take the... He said grenade launcher... Okay, let me read that again. You can put the grenade launcher... 
for Chris because you don't didn't take the Magnum. Okay, so I can put it in the box. Shit, really? Because that would suck. Imagine losing 20 hours of gameplay as a kid because you didn't bring any weapons or enough weapons. I'll bring this, yeah, I'll bring this. I think this is enough for him. He can keep his enhanced Glock. Put it on his cock. Okay, okay, that's what I thought. That's why I thought leave everything for him, but... Uh, I'm just gonna try something here, let's see. Bring that. Claire's still got submachine guns, which have 82% and all everything else. I'll give her the shotgun and the bow gun and the pistol. She'll be more than happy. And then Chris can have the grenade launcher and the assault rifle. I think that's pretty fair. It's gonna be cool seeing Claire with a shotgun, because in RE2 she doesn't have a shotgun. And then bring health. Yeah, don't be stupid. Don't be stupid. Bring some health. Well, he's got more, but there's also final boss. So I'm gonna go one, two, three. And then for her, there's this. Plus she'll find one more. And then there's this. Yeah, we're safe. I'm pretty sure we're safe. Alexia, I hope you're weak to AK-47 bullets. Otherwise, I'm suing. No. Okay, Eileen, I'm coming. I hope your back is as red as I remember it. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> well, if that's it, then she gets the pistol. Everything goes to Chris. Thanks, guys. That really helps avoiding wasting time. She can take all the pistol ammo she wants. There's more here, right? I can remember. And then open the box with her, that's right. And put the shotgun on the wall, that's why I didn't bring the shotgun. Blah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. There you go, flame rounds. Wow. Yeah, Alexia doesn't stand a chance, really. She can be whatever. Hell yeah. A secret grenade stash. Two, her two herbs, he says, okay. Guys, thank you for all the help, really. Your friend appreciates it a lot. This was a game where I didn't have enough ammo near the end. Look at me now, Ma. Look at me now. For Chris, okay? You can do that, though. No. Oh, I don't need that. That's a waste. <laughs> I really don't need it. Chris could then that? Chris could then what? Oh, he could use less than that. Oh. Well, 
I'll leave the jewels and the wings and take all the pistol ammo I can carry, which is quite a lot. He says two herbs, huh? Okay, I'll bring two double greens, because then I can make another double green or more red greens. There you go. Please don't decrease. <laughs> I did, I did, I got the, I got the ammo here, zombie, if that's what you mean. If there's anything else, let me know. So there's nothing there, okay. What? You mean, equip the shotgun or use the shotgun? I don't know which one he means. Bah! I should have ran like last time. Eat a pee pee. Was it here? Was it there? Actually, let's push one by one. That's unpushable. Okay. So there's one pack here. That's bull. Yeah, I, I'll give her that. Okay. I'll give her that. She doesn't even need it, but let's let's say I gave her gave it. What that one's unpushable, really? Nothing there. I guess that one's unpushable. Alrighty then. Is that picture interesting at least? The door is one way. She knows that just by looking at them. Not even looking, just by being in the room. Re locked in from the other side, okay. I, I'm gonna run and see, yeah, where she's gonna pop out of. Get out of my house. Let's try it. Let's start with the last one. It's interesting, because Chris was at the Spencer estate. Claire was not. It's interesting to see her from her perspective. Yeah, I'm gonna pack these up. For all crazy. Man, they're like two people army. They could they could easily literally start a war by themselves. It was the war of Redfields. Nobody saw it coming. We were never prepared for their skills. Chris Redfield. He was quite a hunk. He could punch boulders with ease. Couldn't read though, poor bastard. And then there was Claire. Didn't have much of a brain. She tried looking for a brother she could find all along. God bless her soul. And they did start a war. They did not understand what they were doing. They thought it was just a game. <laughs> Like, how many maps do you need to get the complete map game? <laughs> it's a, we're gonna get the third map of this facility. <clears throat> yeah, I remember this part. <clears throat> I remember it well. Lupka's gonna love it. Anything there? No. Where should I go first, though? I'll try here. No, not airport. B fucking 6F. Okay, we're back to B4F. What a laboratory. <gasps> I remember this. Okay, I'm remembering. So I don't want to go there first. Do I want to go there first? There's gonna be a... Yep, there's something's gonna fall on me, is it? Oh, yeah, G -g 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 -g. yeah, but we're very close. I remember, so last time I beat the game, I remember this was in the same session as I ended it. So we're very close. Am I gonna die? Let's try. Ah, yeah, yeah. Oh, nothing. An anvil of irony. Security file, let's see. 
The Ashford family's most important secret is kept at this lab. As a safety precaution, I have installed a self-destruct device in the control room and have placed it on the activation. Is this Alexia? I gotta see what this is. No, it's Alexander. Okay, okay, a little, as long as it's not Alfred. As a safety precaution, I have installed a self-destruct device in, in the control room and have placed it in the deactivation code inside the computer. Once inputted, all door locks will be released to provide easy access to escape routes. By using the elevator that directly connects to the hangar, one should be able to escape from the lab easily. He's got an unidentified accent. Please remember that I have used the name of my beautiful ancestor for the activation code. Glory to the Ashfords, Alexander Ashford. There's a handle. Do not the handle. You want to trigger the zombie to do it for me? Why am I getting these things? Like, when am I going to use them again? Hmm. Well, let's do it. What's the worst that will happen? The worst that can happen is going to be instant death. Oh, wow. Oh! Oh, that's scary. Yeah, I did get squashed here before. Crystal. A well-polished crystal. It contains a card inside. I'm gonna obtain the card if I crack it. Well, are you in luck? That was really specific. No, not that. Zombie knows what's gonna happen. He's waiting for me to die. I know what's gonna happen, but I'm still, like, scared. Pachar! Okay, there's more time when you do it properly, I guess. Ooh. Okay, okay. Never stops being scary. Se security card, let's see. A card used to release the security lock. Emergency destruction system. It looks like a cassette tape from this side. Where do I want to go first, I guess? Do I want to go up first, or do I want to go back? Is it here first, zombie? To get the thing that I, we're all talking about, <clears throat> that Lyubka doesn't know about? <clears throat> I think it's here first. I don't think I can even go up there first, right? Yeah, with Claire, I don't think... I just did just save, so let, let's just see what happens. Emergency evacuation elevator only works in emergency. What if I go here? I gotta find out. It's like you never tried to save him. Game over. Yeah, that's. Oh, I know where I am now. We're right above the end hill. Yeah, there it is. Just the map is pretty un unaligned. Yeah, nothing. How to release the security. In an emergency, turn both devices simultaneously. It will release once. Charging is completed. The anti-BOW linear launcher should only be used in first-class emergency situations. Well, I'm a peasant. I'm not first-class, so... I guess I'll just go. It's locked. There's a hollow in the shape of a dragonfly, which is why we're collecting all those wings. Lupka? Ready? Maybe I should have saved before doing this. I remember this being super hard. 
So he says two herbs. Yeah, I think two will be enough. Card reader, the security out lock is active. Please leave a message after the beep. Not suspicious at all. Well, I just do it. We don't need weapons anymore, so a charge. Ah, too late, David. Too late. <laughs> She only slowed you What's down. Wrong? That's perfect timing. Claire. Can't breathe. Claire. Help me. Claire. Coming Hulk. Just run, woman. You've seen what happens. No, wait. Do I have to quick turn? I don't remember. Do I have to quick turn or just run? Dead, dead. I did it. I can't believe I did it. Wow. Oh, I thought I fucked it up. Steve is very dramatic. I'm very mixed about this scene. You're warm. Steve, you've got to hang in there. Okay? Mm. Uh, my brother's come to save us. We're getting out of here. You're brother kept his promise. I'm sorry, I cannot. What? What are you saying? I'm glad that I met you. I... I love you. Claire. Even though I knew you for only one night. Oh. Steve? Steve? 
I'm dead, woman. Start, stop shaking me. Okay, that's done. And then instantly this. At last, I found you, Alexia. Come with me. You're responsible for the creation of the T Veronica virus. And now the only existing sample is in your body. I want Sexy it body. Now. You want it? You are not worthy of its power. <laughs> I love these people. Ashfords, man. Ashfords. Oh yes, I need that necklace. What is that? Even Wesker's got his his ass clenched. Here we go, mutant versus mutant. I mean mutant. He really wants her. Sexy West, you won. Alexia, still won. Chris Wesker. Go. Donkey. Pussy. So you're gonna turn. You have a super powered guy there, but you're gonna do this. Ugh. Not ready. Well, that's pretty cool. I didn't know you could do that. Oh, that hurts. Oh, wow, that was quick. Okay. At least I know I can stun lock her. So don't let her touch you. Please. Yes. Yes. At least you're fair game. That's a pretty cool weapon to fight her with. Don't let her touch you. No, no, don't let her touch you. Don't let her touch you. It's the opposite of what I said. Down. Oh, what? You done? Am I done? Oh wow, that's it's that easy. Okay. Did she leave the key behind? Too bad that choir was pretty cool. Ah, there it is. Who? Take the take the Alexia's Joker. Yes. Yeah. It appears the jewel portion can be removed. Take the jewel. Yes, there we go. The metal portion has been removed and you're you obtained the Alexia's jewel. She's gonna come back up. No, she's not. Okay. Bye. Wait, do I need anything else? I do need the key though. Miss, did you leave the key somewhere, perhaps? We we're talking about the biohazard key. Oh look, that's pretty cool. Look at the hole up there. Can't go there. Ah, <laughs> of course. It's been completely cut off. There, the hole where she put her tentacles through to choke Steve. That's pretty cool. She's got the biggest jewels in this family. You still don't know the full story why why I feel bad for Alfred. What did his father, their father do? Yeah, there we go. I knew it. Oh, part two, huh? Oh, no. What about the key, though? Where's the biohazard key? 
Well, I got all three jewels. That's something. Yeah, yeah. True that, but... Uh... Oh, there it is. There's a key item. Yeah, there's the, the other jewels. <laughs> All right. So we have red, we have green, we have blue, we have Pikachu. Pistol, you know, you served me well. You can rest in peace now. Bring the spas. Nailed it. Okay, what else? What what else? I'm gonna use the AR now because because I can. You need other jewels to put in the picture up the stairs. Door upstairs. What door? Door? What door? Hold on. There are a lot of stairs here. So it's probably one of the doors that's locked. That's gonna be my eye. Okay. There it is. But how do you get there? Through that, maybe? That one goes down. Oh, it doesn't go down where I thought it would. Look at all these rooms. They look unexplored. So that door is one way. But that's not where the picture... Oh, I see it. I see the door. Okay, I see it. It's in the fucking mansion. the dragonfly or something I guess yeah we saw the painting up the stairs up the stairs oh she totally did the T double O with that stunt Alexia's jewel goes to her bosom finger ear yeah that goes so he goes got the earring and he's got the ring Wait, what? Oh boy. I, I hoped it would be the key and not another door. Oh, if it's Zambonis. Actually, let's check the hallway. Oh, they're gonna be left and right, okay. So it's the copy of their little house I see one of them will go there nice 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 let's go this one first okay another control room that is not a safe room but is an elevator oh G game code Veronica report after many long years of research, oh, who was this? Alexander, thank God. Oh, thank God. <laughs> After many long years of research, I have finally identified the inheritance element that administers the intelligence of a man. I even succeeded in manipulating the absolute value of intelligence artificially by recomposing the base alignment of the element. I think it's coming, Lupka, the story is coming. I then sampled the gene of our great ancestor, manipulated its element, then implanted it into uh, the unfertilized egg of a surrogate mother. What I didn't expect was 
The twins, a boy and a girl, were born. The boy had higher intelligence than normal, but not high enough for, for him to be considered a genius. However, the girl had unmatched intelligence that easily allowed her to be classified as genius. Genius! She was exactly what I had been looking for. The revival of our great ancestor. I already determined their names. The girl's name, Alexia, and the boy's name, Alfred. I'm certain that Alexia will elevate the name of the Ashford family to extreme glory. Alexander Ashford. So that's why he, they hated their father. Because they found out that they were created in a lab. They were basically clones of Veronica. Which I guess he dug up her corpse and cloned her. And Alfred was a mistake. He was not even supposed to exist. It was just supposed to be Alexia. And we got Alfred, so he, I guess he thought, you know what, the heck with it. Let the boy live. And the boy didn't like that. What the fuck? How many doors are there? Well, it's too late to give up now. That one goes there, where the final boss is. I'm gonna go here, see what, where this goes. Oh, that was, that was a short ride. Can't open this with my hands. Uh, push the button. There you go, another wing. Right, we got four now. I mean, right. Weird places to keep wings. Another door? Oh, that's not a door. Jeez. Large capsule? Actually, no. We're not going to collect those anymore. We're not going to need them ever again. I am close. I remember. Same session. Door jump scare? Are you the door jump scare? Dear Sister Dirty? Hello, Dirty. So that one connects to that. But before, I'm gonna lock it at least. There you go, unlocked. How are you doing, Dirty? Good, uh, good morning, I guess, for you. I remember you being a late nighter. Can't even have spend two minutes with my lighter. Jeez, how did the first one miss? Let's check all the rooms. What's the worst that can happen? Ah! See, that's the worst that can happen. You find a safe room. And I think it's time to save. It's been a while. Nice. Biohazard key. I can take it. Oh, brum, 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 brum. anything in the corner? Like herbs? Nope. Here? Nope. Here? Only useless books. Well, you can't read anyway, Chris. So what does it? it? Makes no difference to you. It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of the Ashford family, Veronica. I mean, if you could show her to us, it would make more sense. No, thank you. Wait, but no box. Oh, we're doing that, are we? Boxes is all the way there and save is all the way here, huh? Being funny game, are you? Okay, I'll, then I'll save right away. Oh, nice. I'm, I'm, I'm glad you're enjoying. My dear sister, Dirty. I mean, my dear sister, Dirty. Ah! I spent my Alfred voice tonight. I read too many F Alfred files. And the box was... Shit. Oh, there's the box. Yeah, that's right. That's right, that's how I get to the box. <laughs> My throat is really tired from doing it. But I have no regrets. 
every fucking Alfred file read in Alfred voice and <laughs> the best approximation of Alfred's voice and You know how he changes tempo when he speaks like a little slow a little fast Shit 15 minutes to IP switch and we're nowhere near end so with that in mind we're still gonna do this tonight because I I'm not leaving this little game for tomorrow. But I really, really gotta hit the bathroom. So we're gonna take a five minute break. I also need to stretch my legs. They're stuck in this chair for four hours. So don't go anywhere. I'll be back in five minutes with more with the finale of Resident Evil Code Veronica X now in HD. Welcome back everyone, welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica X, now in HD, <laughs> on the Xbox 360. We're doing it, we're almost there. Ugh, I feel like I've been in the game myself. I don't want tank controls in real life, dirty. <laughs> Let's see what's behind door number one. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, she's going, she's going away too. <laughs> Nothing, okay, let's do the biohazard key thing, take the jewels. <clears throat> I'm gonna bet it's, I have to put them in one of those doors <clears throat> from before. <clears throat> that didn't help. All right. We still need a dragonfly body, that's probably what's gonna be released from the two jewels. And then when we have a full dragonfly, we can fly away. Not you, kitty. This one's locked from one side, huh? There's something here when you push it. Nope. Yes, kitty, you may come back. I have given you permission. That's locked from the other side. Because the red fields can tell. Just by sniffing the room, they'll like, like lick their finger. Like, oh yeah, this room's locked from the other side. Oh, more weed. Good thing I'm not a police officer anymore. Otherwise, this would be illegal. Ignore the uniform, though. They're gorgeous furnishings, nothing. Yeah, you're a Redfield. You don't get that. You don't get it, do you? People like art. <clears throat> okay, that's where the jewels go. I see. Exactly what I thought. Then I lock the other room and then go back for the jewels. Oh, but this one's playing. So it's the same thing as we did in the original house. No wonder I didn't like this game as a kid. You don't have the time to play this in an arcade. You'll never finish it. <laughs> yeah, there we go. There we go. That's where we bring them. <clears throat> I wonder if it uses literally the same room data. I, this part no, but their their bedrooms, or did they make separate room data for that? What a labyrinth! Oh no, I'm, I I know what I did wrong. <clears throat> I forgot the biohazard key up there. My throat can't take it much longer. I'm going. Ugh. 
which was where there it is Sterile room key. Sterile or sterile? Yes, didn't even see those. Biohazard symbol. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> okay then. That's why there are protective suits there. It makes sense now. <clears throat> that was a little too early, wasn't it? I forget about the delay. <laughs> All right, we don't need it. There, yeah, the the power room, the power room. Anything else? Maybe dump one of these. Ooh la la! Here we go. Here we go. We're doing the French, French hip, French EP, EP Frenchy. But this time we're not going here. We're going here instead. Creepy. This is I, Leclerc. Ouvre la porte. Then run down the corridor. Then take the jewels. Oui, oui. Then say Baba. Shh. I will restore the power now. Because we need some light. Illumination. Run crazy. Run! This scary door is opening. Power! More power! Ha 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 ha! Run through the frozen corridor and then, then again through another door. I mean, port. That was my knuckle. It cracked pretty good, like a crackhead. Like a crackhead with crackers on crack. Oh, bro. Apologies, I have to decapitate you. You too, monsieur. You too. Especially you. Oui, oui. Where are the zombies? I have no idea where the zombies are. Oh, shit. Merde. I do have one shell left. Eat lead, mother buzzer. Ha 
hasta la vista. <laughs> here we go, here we go. Wrong room. Yeah, that's from Conquer's Bad for a Day. You'll see one day. I didn't stream that in a year. Rajul, a blue jewel. A large red ruby that appears to be a decoration. Used. Oh, it's happening. It's happening. It's happening. Let's well, just wait for everything to come back. Stream has stopped. Uh, the IP has been changed. Uh, stream is reconnecting. It shall be done in a second or so. Come on, stream. Come back. We need you, stream. Reconnecting to chat. Welcome to the chat room. Uh, Reconnecting. I can see the chat, but I cannot see this. The stream is not starting. Attempting to reconnect. Are we back? Here we go. Here we go. We are back. We are back. Welcome. Welcome back, everyone. That was the IP switch. Refreshing shot. What has happened in the chat while well, I was uh, non existent during that? very small window oh oh my like refreshing the chat went like to 40 percent cpu geez it's just chat man it's http you have so much on your stream list and mine uh -huh. the you mean because Conquer, yeah, we streamed uh, both. Well, the Con Conquer's Bad for a Day and its sequel last winter. And I said I'll do the remake one time, and I will. I'll do the remake. We'll get to that. And then again, the original Conquer. There's a. Oh, really? You don't say. It's only been two minutes. <laughs> There's a music box plate. Take it. Take it all. Goodbye. And put the blue jewel in here. That's the sapphire. The chat is still not on the stream. It takes a few minutes for uh, the chat bot to understand what's going on. Just a few more weeks of this. Patiently. We'll get there. Non existent, <laughs> non existent. <laughs> yeah, sounds legit. Okay, I can't see shit here. Hello, game. We. Oui. Nothing useful. Not even bullets. Oh, those are not bullets. They look like bullets, but they're not bullets. There we go. That's the last part I need. Yes. Now we can talk. Oh, what's going to jump in from there? Looks like an anthill. There's nothing left. Just bullets? Nope. What is this? Man's portrait is displayed here. So after you take it, oh wow, that's a very weird camera angle. You gotta, oh ant hill. I get it because they would pluck their, pluck their wings out and feed them to the ants. Okay, that's why that's there. No, whatever I find, it's not as important as any key items. I have a whole arsenal on me, and it's not like you can use a lot in the boss battle. So we're good. Let's go assemble that. 
Dragonfly and then... Where was I supposed to use it? After I assemble it, it'll just tell me. Bye. That's the box is right there. Hello, box. That should be here. Yep. Why, hello there. There we go, we got the whole dragonfly. Dragonfly object made of jewels and gold. All the wings are attached. Now you just gotta find that giant anthill. Which I'm sure I saw somewhere. There? I doubt it was there. It was a big anthill. Very hard to miss. But in these 75 rooms... That's locked. Can't go... Oh! Is it though? Huh. What, that's it? They can't be it. Isn't it final boss time? It's a little too early, isn't it? Where's the anthill? Game, show me the anthill. Let's, let's look at this. From all angles. Those rooms can't have the anthill, I know. So, this one doesn't have it. This one doesn't have it. Nor this one, nor this one. And this one definitely doesn't have it. So we'll clear that floor. That floor? I don't think it's here. Is it here though? No, no, it's not here. Is it though? What was in this room? It was dark. That's it. That's where it is. There we go. That's it. Yeah, it was dark and zombie was like, what the fuck are you doing there? I was like, I don't know what I'm doing, zombie. I suck at this. And then, you know what happened. Okay. Or is it? Claire? Is that you, Claire? Chris? No! The door won't open! Hey, is Steve with you? Nope. Steve, <laughs> What's up with your ear, man? We have to get a little out of pixelated. Can you unlock it from the inside? No, I can't. It's not a boulder, Chris. system somewhere if you activate it all the electronic locks might be deactivated might be if not though what as an item it's pretty cool she gave him the file and all All right, those are the key items we need. Now I gotta get to that anthill. What if I came here earlier? But I'll start the... I do want to use the anthill. I'm gonna go to the anthill. Fuck it. Let's see. If not, then... Um, Then I'll just save at least. Yeah, it was this way. That's right.
That's cool music. Wait, if I did that right away, would the music follow me the, the entire time? Yeah, the giant anthill, right? I thought I need to put this on a giant anthill. Well, if not, then fuck everything. <laughs> I'm, I'm out of here. The box and the... Oh, shit, it's one... You know what? I'm going to the, the actual item box. Yeah, okay. Then I'm just gonna equip myself, save, and run. A dead room that has both the uh, item box and... And the typewriter. Looking for the note. All right. Can I, can I just refill it? Oh, there you go. Just fill it with bullets. Nice. If I'm even gonna use it. That. Drop the shotgun. Wow, so many. Look at all these bullets. <laughs> uh, I could have totally used all that. Drop that. Just activate the self-destruct system, I guess. Bring. So what I'll need is the GL with all the acid rounds I can muster. What do you mean no explosive? As in like explosive rounds? I I, I was thinking flame rounds because ants. Wait no. Wait no. She's immune to that, is she? What are the flame rounds in for this in this game? I never I haven't used a single flame round. <laughs> The entire game. Bring that. The assault rifle. I'm gonna save four of these. One, two, three, four. This and that. And then exchange that for this and save. I think that's it. For the explosive. Sheesh. What do you mean, Ditch AK? I've been saving it for this moment. Why didn't you say anything earlier, you bastard? Oh my god, I've been saving the AR, the AR all the game for this moment, and he tells me now, leave the AR. Oh, that's a kick in the balls. Okay, I guess then I'll bring uh, more flame rounds. And then uh, put that in. Put that in and then put that in. That should be more than enough. I'm gonna use that and that, and I'm gonna have two slots for what we need. If we need slots for that, and that that's about it. That's about it. <laughs> Thanks, zombie. Oh, I didn't see where was that save? Oh never mind. Was that the L? What's, what's L here? Charge! Shitty weapon. That's a really good weapon. Did you see what it did to her? Nah, let's... I have a wish to try it. Honestly, I do have a wish. Next time, I guess. We'll try it. Because it's got fast rate of power and a lot of uh, stun. So, remember, we did find we did find that uh, crossbow can be very useful. I'm guessing this could be... Was it this way? Yeah, it was this way. Yeah, okay, I got everything. I was hoping it would be a good weapon, like it was for Alexia. Well, the Alexia. Let's 
look this way? No, it's straight ahead, yeah. I thought I saw a red herb. Really? Okay, let's do it. Fuck it, let's try it. I, why, I didn't save for nothing. Where's this box? It's right there, it's close by. Box is the blue one, right? Yeah, let's try it. I'll, I'll dump the fire flame rounds. I haven't used them at all. <laughs> I don't know if she... Sh she... Because she's... Wait, her ants should be weak. Oh, fuck it, just go. I gotta try it. I'm hoping it'll do like some kind of a stun like it did in the first battle. <laughs> What's that way? Back and forth? <laughs> no, wait, wrong door, wrong door. <laughs> New way. <laughs> you do the... You step forward, step back, step forward, step back. So, fuck flame rounds for now. Let's try this instead. Let's see what happens. I don't remember Alexia first form ever being that easy without the assault rifle. Maybe with the knife like Wesky? But can I kill you? No? Okay. He, he, the, the AK kind of suits him, doesn't it? Yeah, I thought that too. I honestly did think that for the longest time. Was it here? I don't know. It's locked. Ah, there we go. That's where I needed to use that. I know I saw it. I am tired. <laughs> you unlock the door, right? And you can, you can still put the flame rounds in if you really wish. When it turns out that the flame rounds are their, their weakness, it's going to be really funny. <laughs> I guess here's a good spot to use the explosive rounds. Here's that's the sir. Like what the hell is that? Would you think we're this is a motherfucking game? I'll give you one foot. Ah. Just to get? Oh, okay. Then bring my foot back. Fine and dandy. There you go. What's the code? Always the time. More greens. Jeez, game, you're too too kind to me. There's a terminal. Here's the release for the self-destruct system. Use the security card. Here we go. It's time. You put a security card in the card slot. Self-destruct safety lock release system. Please enter the security code. Oh, I wonder what it could be. I will never guess what this code could be in a thousand years. Oh, could it be Anne? Maybe Lucy? Perhaps it's Jill? We're only... Nope, that's not it. Oh, no. <laughs> released. All door locks have been released in order to help expedite the evacuation process. Here we go. It's time. Where to? Go for. We'll go back for Claire. Oh, the timer through the doors. Isn't that lovely? Here we go. Come on, let's get out of here. What is his face look squished in the cutscenes? What 
are we gonna do? Okay, turn the key clockwise simultaneously on three. Got it. Takes like five minutes to release it, huh? Gotta do it. I'll keep her busy. Just go for the emergency elevator. Chris, but I can take care of this. Just go. Let's split up. We haven't seen each other in you six have months. To make it. Don't die on me. I don't plan to. Oop. Yes, no. Oh, that was too slow. God damn it. I thought I had the AK on. Fuck. <laughs> yes, please. Okay, at least we're back here. Not the lighter. That's not gonna scare her. <laughs> After all of that, oh, at least it's like it's very it's very kind with uh, reset points. I think that's the first RE that did that, didn't bring you back to the actual typewriter, but <laughs> but here. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I'll take care of it, bye! <laughs> yes, just go. This facility will Skip it! Skip it! Five. B5, B4, B2, B... Are those, like, explosives for different floors? <laughs> oh, that's, that's the that was the best death in this playthrough. Just one bullet. Mutating into the giant ant lady? Ah, don't send your kids to do your dirty work. Ow. Watch the help. Nailed it. To stop that. Ow. Oh shit, I've totally forgot she can do that. Heal randomly. Try this. That's not doing her much. Did that hurt? I can I can make it worse. They can run when they're in danger here, so I can't know how much HP I got. Oh, jeez, it's gonna be... Just take one, I guess. Wow, gang up on me, will you? Am I dead? I'm not dead. Man, you can take a beating, Chris. Jeez, stun lock. So, I I'll, I think I'll have to reload the save just to get the. Stop it! I can't tell what's my HP. 
Oh, okay. No, he, that was danger. I can tell. Uh, what's the smart thing to do? I know. Yes. We got this. I gotta clear that poison. I don't know how to see. Oh, uh, I'm not. I don't need the leaderboards. I just need the game to work. No, 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 no. We don't know yet, zombie. Hold on. We don't know what the damage is. Uh, that's what I want to see. And if I can just aim up and shoot her in the face, that would really help. But just to make this easier, because it's 1025. Maybe quit it? As in quit the experimentation? Just flame, huh? Well, that's boring. That's really, after all of this, that's really boring. So not the AK, like on like on her first form. Man, that's really sad. <laughs> so much ammo for nothing. Here's what we're gonna do then. I can carry one more thing then. I guess just a blue herb. Or, or oh, another one. Good. There you go. Five this time. Can't fuck up now. Oh, you can always fuck up. And that's all, folks, right? Look at all this unused ammo. Look and weep. Well, I will. I could have had some, so much more fun. But we'll know for the next time. Not even the Magnum. <laughs> Not even the fucking Magnum. I'm wrong then. I have to be wrong. Because uh, I would have remembered the Magnum from this game. Which means I never got the Magnum. Which means I never remembered to bring the thing. But I thought I did. But I didn't. So it was... Uh, to the mansion. I'm dying here. <laughs> I mean, in real life. It's very late. It was all worth it. Here? No? Actually, yes, that's where I need to go. Damn, it's such a confusing map. Even for a map enthusiast. Oh yeah, I don't want to waste... I'm going to waste an acid on a zombie, see what happens. I'm actually pretty interested. Here? Yeah, here. Damn, I want to see you. I want to see you when I blow you up. What the, what the fuck? Just, it's acid, dude. Just... Oh, wow. All right. Then no acid for you guys. Really? No, I got to try that again. That's interesting. The 
first one really didn't give a shit. You yes, acid should kill him in one go. So you can kill a hunter. Oh no. You can kill a hunter in this game in one go, but not the uh, but not a zombie. Interesting. Interesting. Ah uh, yeah, no, not now. I wonder if I connected the Xbox chat pad, would it work? I doubt it. <clears throat> I seriously doubt it. Twenty-two thirty. Oh, it's showing my real time. Like, look, it's showing the real time. In, in. Yep, it's showing the real time. <laughs> Over here, twenty-two thirty. Well, that's an excellent detail. Makes sense because the Dreamcast was the first home console I know of that had a real-time clock in it. Isn't that magnificent? No, it was Saturn. I'm sorry. Saturn had it before Dreamcast. That's right. Saturn had it. The Saturn is the Sega Saturn is the is the easy is the is the first one I remember having that. That's that's a, a very nice detail. I wouldn't have noticed. I don't even know how I noticed that. <laughs> Either that or it was a wild coincidence that it's showing the same time as here. <laughs> wow. Just kudos. Bravo. The game deserves a remaster, remake, with a gold medal and all. Acid, bitch. Oh, okay, that didn't work the way I planned. I'm still fine and then. Hey, wait, wait, wait. We got these, right? Shoot! Shoot, for the love of God, man! Are you fucking crazy? Ouch. How did that miss you, dude? Can I take one more, huh? Should I risk it? Nah. Be smart this time. In the belly, yeah. Dodge. Ow. Stop that. Stop it. Quit it. They're more annoying than G babies. There we go. You poisoned me. Happy? Finding dandy. Three more. Come on, you can do it. Stop it. This is not fun. This is not my idea of fun. Stop it. Yeah, it is. Jesus Christ. What the fuck? Who, who? <laughs> she is the ultimate bioweapon. Nope. Can't do it while they're there. And that guy avoids it. Isn't that wonderful? Stop that. I already said it. No, not check. No time to check. Shit, Chris, you can't read anyway. Just die. 
I can take a few more hits before decomposing completely. Okay. Sheesh. It's happening. I remember this. This was badass. Then it's still badass. I'm sure. Well, <laughs> it's not over yet. You can't miss with this, can you, right? Bye! Guys, you're very confident in me. Thank you very much. But uh, <laughs> like, uh, like we have established, I'm not really good at this game. Especially at aiming first person in it. Oh, infinite. Now you give me an infinite thing. Linear launcher. Anti-BOW linear launcher. An advanced weapon developed to handle BOWs. Well, am I in luck? I just got one right here. Oh, where are you? Wow, she can dodge. That's pretty cool. Will I die? Not yet. It's very hard to kill me. How the fuck do I hit her? Dodge and then hit, I guess. Oh, yeah, finally. Ugh. Thanks for putting your trust in me. <laughs> This is it, right? This is it. I can put the controller down, Bye. hands free. We did it. Chris, uh, move. Uh, oh wow, no. it's not over. Is it? I don't remember. I thought she was the final boss. She has to be the final boss. So much is so much is drawn well in the game's done, engines. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker. Good night, zombie. You don't want her. Thanks for sticking around, man, and all the help. Where? Kitty, Today we're watching the end, Kitty. Day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even. Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia is gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? You got Steve. Steve. I forgot about In that. In his body, there's still a living T Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alive just as I did and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart, but my men have already taken you. You get out of here, way. But what about? As a surviving member of Stars, I have to thank you. Remember your promise. What is going on? I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who you've killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. That is gonna be a badass, I guess. Lyubka, are you alive? I don't think she's still up. Evacuate immediately. <laughs> it's 
quite an ending. Keeps going and going like the game. It is kind of like a Metal Gear game, yeah. The strongest vibrations at the very end. Not my pretty face, Next my sexy time. wesky face. Don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs> I remember how underwhelming this was. I expected another boss battle, anything. It's just like this? This is what you're gonna do? So Wesker got the submarine to get here. That's so many cool details. Chris, where are you? All right, that's the emergency elevator we saw with Chris when he came in. And these ants, I swear to God, I know wasps and ants are pretty close cousins, but these ants are pretty much wasps. keep my promises <laughs> not even a singed butt oh you can you can even pilot the veto what cannot what you can't do man what can't you do chris promise me please promise that you won't leave me alone again i'm sorry claire but it's not over yet there's still something we've got to do i am a human totally not a robot yeah. beep, beep, beep. Time. we've got to destroy umbrella now Let's Michael this Bay helped in this scene, in this game. He helped in this game and in the outbreak scenario when we blow, blow up the streets. The fuck did you? Was it in that self-destruct mechanism? Amazing game, awfully goofy, but fucking amazing. <laughs> the story is five out of ten. Gameplay, on the other hand. Nine and a half out of ten. Almost ten. Oh boy. Yeah, yeah, I, I, I laughed about that too, zombie. I laughed about that too. <laughs> Steve could pilot the cargo plane straight out of prison. <laughs> Starved, tortured, <laughs> but he was like, yeah, you gotta pilot this. Yeah, I, I want to say 9, but I, I I feel like I'm going to... It went up for me. So probably because it was so low and it jumped very high up, it's going to... It's going to level... It's all going to level at some point. Or not. I am still amazed at the fucking... Are you there, Lyubka? We thought you fell asleep. <laughs> Did you see that spectacle? <laughs> 
this was so yeah like i said more code veronica this year we gotta do this i think i didn't like like ultimately i didn't like it i was, I was younger because it got me tired every fucking time which is two times finished right it got me tired it's a long game but now thinking about it unlike uh, re4 which is tiring boring long like it re4 overstays its welcome for me for a long time like after the, the castle afterwards but this is a different kind of long because now I see what they were doing you know I see how the maps have changed I didn't appreciate that as a kid bravo just amazing Yupka's in between sleep and uh, and, uh, <laughs> and and awakening wow just wow so is there anything past the credits well no I'm not gonna do the battle game tonight oh thank you David Thank you, man. Thanks, everyone. <laughs> I'm gonna keep it long tonight. I have overstayed my welcome. <laughs> I'm gonna raid. Let's see. I'm gonna raid a fellow streamer. And go to rest. An hour and a half longer than I thought. We totally could have been another episode. Let's see, last la, la, next time, if I can do it in two tries, like Thank two. Thank you! One, uh, first Bye. part until the save, and then second part from the save. I think I can do it. Not, not, not necessarily next time. A few repetitions, and I should be there. Thank you guys so much. No, oh, fuck it, Doc is doing Survivor. Let's, let's, let's switch to uh, Survivor. Oh, don't don't do that yeah all right enjoy the end credits if you will on youtube and as for you twitchers there say hi to doc till next time